All right, let's see if I can remember how to stream. Make sure I'm going live here. <laughs> there we go. Now let's see if anybody shows up. I didn't make any announcements that I was going live. I'm gonna post on YouTube though. Um, I'm back on Twitch, come hang out with me. See if anybody shows up. Hopefully this still sends out my notifications and hopefully I remember how to do everything. Uh, all right. I'll wait until somebody gets in here before I get started. I'm going to be playing some more Test of Time Challenge today. Uh, if I get viewers. Bill says I have zero viewers. I'm worried that it's not going to send out notifications that I'm live and I didn't let anybody know I was going live, so... Hopefully this isn't like a five minute stream. Um, but I want to play the Test of Time Challenge today. I don't remember what I'm doing in the challenge, so I hope somebody can remember where we left off. Hey, saucy kitten. Hey, Tia. Okay, here you guys come. I was getting worried there for a second. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hey, Carson. Oh my gosh, it's going so fast now. Hello, 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 everybody. Oh, thank God. Oh my God, why is that so big? Why is that so big on the screen? <laughs> That's huge. Oh, thank you so much for the resub, uh, Melancholic Ovoid. Thank you so much. <laughs> I don't know why that's taking up so much screen space right there. It's like covering up my whole face. <laughs> um, but hope can you guys, is the music too loud? It sounds really loud to me. I need a sound check. Uh, thank you so much for the tier one sub, Angie, C821. Thank you for the, giving out the gift sub, Triggered Latina. Thank you so much. I don't know who you gave a gift sub to, but thank you. Uh, thank you for the one month resub, Sin Christy. Thank you for the, uh, 20 month resub, Christina. Oh, hello, Christina. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I don't know what's going on with my alerts, y'all. So, I hope I can remember how to stream, because I haven't streamed on here in seven months. Can you believe it's been that long? I went to look at my last stream, it was like seven months ago, and I was like, oh my god, I hope I can remember what to do. <laughs> uh, thank you, Pink Wisteria. Thank you so much. It's so good to see you guys, too. I have missed streaming so much, let me tell you. Thank you so much, Butterfly C, for the one month uh, su tier one sub. I really appreciate that. Uh, everybody who's subbing, I really appreciate you. Thank you for 10 months, Draculia. Thank you. I'm so happy to be back, y'all. I can't even tell you how much I miss streaming, like, so much. I've been wanting to stream so bad. But I was hoping I could do it today. The baby is great. I am pregnant, and I have a kidney stone. I didn't drink enough water in my first trimester when I was really sick, and now I have a kidney stone, and it hurts. Like hell, but I think I finally got, you know, to a point where I'm stable, but I haven't passed it yet. This sucks. It freaking sucks. I'm drinking. I'm drinking I'm drinking three liters of water a day at least. I forgot to tell Andrew to get me some cranberry juice. Uh thank you so much for the 13 month prime resub, Miss Cora Sims. Thank you. And I hydrated for you, Blue Space Boy. Thank you so much for your congratulations. Yeah, I had one last year in February and I've got another one now. So I have had a lot of kidney stones in my life. I'm like one of those people who just formed, is more susceptible to forming them. And I'm bad at drinking enough water. And when I was in my first trimester of pregnancy, like I couldn't, I couldn't keep stuff down very well. So I think I got too dehydrated and that's what, that's what happened. Drink your water, everybody. You do not want a kidney stone. It's a little one, so... It's not as painful as my other ones were, but it still sucks really bad. Uh, hello, hello. Thank you so much, Beaky, 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 for the 21 months. Thank you. And thank you, Hula Zombie, for the nine months. I really appreciate it, guys. Uh, thank you, Tomb Raiders. Whew. 
I'm gonna burp. Anyway, so I was looking back at my, my last stream I did seven months ago. I was like, my hair was so short. Because look how long it is now. Look at that. I got hair, y'all. Re this is my real hair. Can you believe that? And I could I haven't even... I after I got pregnant, I haven't been able to take my medication that I was taking to help my hair grow. So I think it's just like pregnancy that's helping it. Aw, thank you. Thanks, guys. Uh, thanks so much for the 17 months, Tristesse. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. And thank you for the 300 bits, Rakowski. Thank you guys. I'm really I'm really happy with my hair. Like it's not perfect. Like you can see it's still got some little spots that are thin, but I'm so happy with it like this. Like it's so much better than it was. Uh Hendrick, thank you so much for 18 months and hello Hendrick. Thank you. Uh thanks guys. Oh, uh, thank you Triple Consonant. I appreciate that. So, I said, I said Rakowski. Now I can't say it right. I said it right one time. I can't say it right again. So yeah, we're going to play Test of Time Challenge today, y'all. And I don't remember what the heck we were doing in there. I went and looked in the game and I was like, I don't know what I was doing. We're just going to jump in there and see. Uh, yeah, pregnancy does help hair growth. It's crazy. It's help, It's My hair's growing like crazy now. And I'm like, please don't go away after I have the baby. I think my kidney stone's on the move, y'all. It hurts. But let me show you this. This is how much water I'm drinking in a day. I gotta drink, this is three liters of water. So I just fill this every up every day and I drink this, try to drink this whole thing. That's all how much I've drank today. So I got it over here so I can fill it up. Ooh. I've got it in an ice chest. I'm prepared. <laughs> Thank you so much for three months at Tier 1 Melzy's Games. Thank you for the 100-bit Spider in the Sim. And thank you for the nine months, Rita. Thank you. I'm so glad to be back. I missed you guys. I missed talking to you guys. I missed streaming. Yes, I will upload this to YouTube on my streaming channel. Yeah. Yeah. I will. We're going to get in there. I just want to say hi to you guys. Uh, Fijor. Uh, by Jor. I hope I'm saying that right. Thank you so much for the uh, five months. Thank you. I really appreciate you saying that. That's really nice. I'm so happy to be having a baby too. Y'all, uh, I have, I'm, you want to see, you want to see my bump? <laughs> Look at this. I gotta go way back here. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Babby is formed. Um, I'm 20 weeks pregnant uh, tomorrow. So that's five months. I only got four months to go. But everything's going great so far. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Thank you, Coffee Gamer, for the prime sub. My due date is December 11th. December 11th. But, uh, my midwife said that I could, I'll most likely go late because it's my first baby. I just hope it's born before Christmas. You know, your sister's pregnant and she's due in November, Hendrick. Congratulations, you're going to be an uncle. That's so exciting. Uh. Thank you so much uh, for the nine month resub, Kaz. And thank you for the eight month prime sub, Meadow Thayer. Meadow Thayer subscribed to me. I feel so How honored. Baby formed. How girl get pregnant? I have no idea. I have no idea how that happened. Thank you so much, Floss697, for the 14 months. And thank you for the 300 bits, Therese. Babby bump. <laughs> it makes me tear up too because I never thought I could have it. I never thought I could have a kid. I never thought I could get pregnant. And it's a miracle. It's a miracle. I'm gonna be, I'm an old mom though, y'all. I'm uh, I'm 39, having my first baby, so I'm kind of scared about being an old mom, you know? But also I hope like she'll keep me young, you know? Thank you so much for the nine month resub Rip Grunt. Rip Grunt is also subscribed to me, y'all. I'm so special. <laughs> and thank you for the four months, Miss Contorta. Oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. 
That's so sweet of you to say. And thank you for these six months. Valamolarova. Hope I said that right. That's a, that's a fun name to say. Valamolarova. I look younger. Thank you. I have good genes, man. My mom, before my mom passed away, she was in her 60s and she didn't have a single gray hair on her head. She looked like she was 40, I swear. She looked really young, but I already have gray hair, so I didn't get I didn't get blessed that much. <laughs> Rip and Meadow in chat today, yes. Okay, I've been I've been talking for 10 minutes, so I guess we'll get to the game too. I'll keep chatting with you guys though. Um, I look like I'm in my 20s. That's a nice compliment. I feel like I look at least 30. <laughs> Your mom was pregnant with you at 41? Oh, that's awesome. Because I already, like, the first trimester, I was like, this is my only kid. I will never do this again. This is so miserable. And then, like, as soon as second trimester hit, I was like, hey, Andrew, what do you think about having a second baby after this one? <laughs> I'm like, I want another one now. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, um... Uh, Mikhail, Mikhail Day. <laughs> Mikhail Day, that's what it is. All right, do I have any names in mind for the baby? Yes, we do have a name picked out, but I'm gonna wait. I'm not gonna tell you till she's born, but we have a name. I uh, thank you so much for the 100 bit, Stefamo. Your grandma had your youngest at 48? Wow, that's like a miracle. I know I already rolled the one. I'm now I'm a family sim, y'all. I changed into a family sim. As soon as the baby, as soon as the baby's born, I'm gonna roll a new one. Have another baby. I'm gonna be like Cassandra Goth. <laughs> uh, would I be surprised if I had kids? Well, no, because I got one bacon in my stomach right now. <laughs> it's not gonna be a surprise to me. <laughs> Thank you, Pixel Dreams. You just became a mom yourself. Congratulations, that's awesome. Thank you so much for the Prime resub, San Maro. I hope you guys don't mind that I'm staying in chat a little bit longer today just because I haven't seen you guys in so long. We have so much to talk about. If you're watching this back on YouTube, feel free to fast forward. <laughs> you don't want to hear me talk. Uh, thank you so much for the nine months, Amy Pay. Thank you. Oh, you guys are so kind. 24 subs and 900 bits. Thank you. Thank you, River. <laughs> I don't have the 18-hour pregnancy mod. God, I wish I did in real life. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I'm ready for December to get here. <laughs> oh, thank you, guys. 100 baby challenge. No. <laughs> no. If I... All I would ever have is two, I think. I think that's all I have time to have. Before my eggs go dry. <laughs> oh, thank you, Pixel Dreams. I forgot what family we're on, too. But I think we can go in and look at how many kids they have and see. If anybody remembers what family we're on in the Test of Time Challenge, let me know. Thank you so much for the 17 months, Prixie Pay. Thank you. What's pregnancy like? I don't know how to describe that. The first trimester is like a living hell. At least it was for me. I was sick the whole time. But now in the second trimester, I feel really good. Uh, thanks so much for the three month prime sub Vila Dragon 24. I was on the first household. Okay, thank you, Nathan. Thank you, Nathan. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump into the, into the game here. Let me find my, let me find my bearings. All right, there we are. So, how's the pregnancy affecting my diet? Well, um, as you may or may not know, I lost 40 pounds before I got pregnant, which is like, I think that's why I was able to get pregnant. And But I've gained 10 pounds back, or probably about 11 pounds by now. So I'm not worrying about trying to lose weight while I'm pregnant. I'm gonna wait till after the baby's born and then I'm gonna try to lose more. Cause it's just, yeah, I have a lot of food aversions and I can only eat certain stuff and it's just weird. Yes, I remember somebody's wife died. Somebody died. Who was it? It was Stone. It was Stone. What was her name? I forgot her. <laughs> 
Uh, thank you so much for the 16 month resub, Floof Gerbit. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, Chelsea. It was, oh, it was Moon. It was Moon. It was Moonstone. <sighs> yes, it was Moon. She is gone. But, so we played the Tiny Leaves. So let's just go over the families. We played the, she died and came back and died again. Yes, that's exactly what happened. That was crazy. Um, yes, Shaylin, same thing for me. In my first trimester, I could hardly eat any meat. The only thing I could eat was like really processed meat, like chicken nuggets. But I feel like it looked like meat. I couldn't eat it. I was eating like a lot of beans and stuff in my first trimester. But now, I, now I'm okay with meat. Uh, thank you so much for the prime sub, Musibaka. Ooh. I hope I said that right. That stream was a roller coaster. So this family, the Tiny Lee family, they have three kids because they they had the first kid to turn into a toddler, and then they had twin babies. If I'm remembering this cor correctly, we've got Barry, Twig, and Fern. I'm live. I'm here. It is not a dream. <laughs> And so this family is actually, they were, I remember that being very hard. Okay. So then we were playing the Spears family again. Now, Nathan, did we get all the way through the Spears family day? Or are we still playing them? Because everybody, I look through here and everybody's on summer. So I don't remember. The twin rage. Yes. Yes, I do remember that. Because having twins in this challenge is really, really hard. Spears as in Britney Spears. No, Spears as in I'm going to spear my my buffalo with a spear and eat it. <laughs> no, I'm not going to bring the Discord back. Sorry. But it's just like I don't have the time or the energy or the desire to manage a Discord. And when I tried to leave it before, it just kind of went to hell. So <laughs> I'm probably not going to bring that back. You miss a nut. <laughs> Thank you. Your test of time challenge world already has children that are grown. That's crazy. Thank you so much. If I didn't say it, Lavindy. Thank you uh, for the prime resub summer bees. Thank you for the tier one 19 months at tier one. Akira the drama queen. Thank you for the 19 months plat ass. And thank you for the 15 months, Lucky Lucy. And hello, everybody. Welcome back. I'm just going to go in here. We're going to check the Spears family. I don't know if Nathan answered me. I got to go look through the chat. I knew Nathan would remember what family I was on. Nut was an icon. Well, don't we have a nut in this challenge? Yeah, that's true, Christina. I don't need the, that kind of stress. I don't need the stress of the Discord in my life, to be honest. Caleb! Hello, I missed you. Oh, I gotta hydrate too. Thank you for reminding me. Oh, Nikki's here? I missed you, Nikki, but hello. <laughs> my cat is doing great. He's doing really well. Okay, actually, I think it's time for us to change because it's 6.14 in the morning. Now, don't we usually change in the morning? Y'all got to remind me. I haven't played this in seven months. <laughs> Thank you for the four months sushi. I don't remember if I said that or not. We do change in the morning. Okay, so I think we're going on to the next family. So let's head back out to the neighborhood. Wait, let's check out what this family's got going on. They got a garden. They've got a bed. Oh, and they even have a little shack for their babby. And they have Lance Spears. Okay, so they're, do they're doing pretty good. I know we have one family that's like lagging behind the other families, but I can't remember who it was. Is Pleasant View coming back? I'm, I've been thinking about doing another Pleasant View episode. I don't want to 100% say yes, but I'm thinking about it. Now we're moving on to the drinks. Hot drinks. Hot drinks, cold drinks, and little baby Luke drinks. <laughs> Lukewarm drinks. His middle name's Warm. It's so good to see you guys again, too. Hello, Pootie Mancer. 
This is the test of time challenge. So if you put in the chat, what is my chat command for the challenge rules? I don't remember. It's making me accept my own rules. Stream info. Okay, there's the, in the chat, there's the link to the rules of this challenge. It's the test of time challenge for The Sims 2. And the, those rules are my rules, how I play. Uh, thank you so much for the one month tier one sub Calico Y2. Thank you. Okay. What year would I say this is in game? What year were Neanderthals around? <laughs> That's what year. <laughs> uh, I know I could, I, I'm surprised. Well, the only reason I remember the commands is because I went and looked at them before the stream to make sure I didn't have any commands on there that weren't relevant anymore. How am I coping in this heat? I have my AC cranked to the max um, every single day. Oh my god, he wants to woohoo in bed. Um, I'm just checking out this family, y'all. Wait, why is it Saturday at 3.15 a.m.? I guess we left them. Did we skip the other household? Now I don't know. Now I'm wondering if we had just switched to the other household and hadn't played them yet. Does anybody know? Thank you so much for the two month prime sub, Kayla K198. Oh, a screenshot? You want what do you want a screenshot of? The garden? Gosh, I don't remember how to take a screenshot. There we go. <laughs> Thank you, vegan cow plant. I'm so happy about the baby too. Thank you so much, uh, Tegan Malone, for the nine-month resub. Thank you for the tier one, Odie Leiden. And thank you for the 14 months, JD89. Thanks, guys. Was I on this household? Oh, God, I don't remember. I think I want to go back and play the other family. Oh, I'm so glad. Thank you, Alien Spotting. I'm so glad you got Sims 2 going. Nobody knows, y'all, so I think I'll go back and play the other family. It's like, I don't want to give anybody an unfair advantage here. Stones were the last family I played. Okay. Thank you, Nathan. You are on, you are on the ball. So that means we are playing Spears today. That means we are playing Spears. Thank you, Nathan. I, I appreciate that. Uh, thank you so much for the 10 months, Maria Jasmine. 333. Three, three. So we did just switch to the Spears family. That's what it is. Have I thought what my stream schedule will be? I think I'm going to keep doing it on Saturday. It will probably be earlier than today's stream. I got a late start today because my kidney stone issues. Um, but I think I'm going to do it. keep going on Saturdays for now. Aw, thanks, Caleb. I missed you guys so much. Okay, so now we... Oh my god, she's got heat stroke. Yes! They keep having a freaking heat stroke because it's so hot. There's like a gnat in here. Oh, thank you for giving out a gift sub, Beaky Beaky Beaky, to Bricklion26. Yes, again. I know, I have another kidney stone. It's because I didn't drink enough water in my first trimester because I was really sick. I know that's what it is. All right, so we've got Arrow Spears and Raven Spears. And I don't know what they're up to. He, She wants to get a bronze fishing talent badge. He wants to do a bunch of stupid crap. <laughs> and they have a baby, but they have to try for baby again. I don't know if she's prego, but they have to try for baby every day. <laughs> Yeah, we're in the Northern Hemisphere. You can be hot in solidarity with these Sims, yes. Andrew is doing very, very well. He is doing great. He's going to get a massage. <laughs> He's about to go get a massage. I'm jealous. I'm like, I want a massage. I should get a pregnancy massage. Um. Oh, I gotta hydrate. And thank you so much for the 14 months, Victorious. So the first thing we're going to do with this family is you better get over here and relax. 
That's that's gonna heat them up even more. Yeah, I need to send her across the street so we can put her in the waterfall and cool her off. Oh no, the baby's crying. No, no, hold on, hold on. Somebody's gotta take care of the baby real quick. Hold on. Let's have her go inside. Maybe she can cool off while she's taking care of the baby. Um, let's cuddle him and nurse him. Thank you. I know my hair. I'm so happy with how my hair is. It, I, I kind of want to get it like trimmed maybe, but I'm happy with how it looks. Oh my gosh, come back. Thank you so much forever, Haley, for the prime sub. Thank you, mystery. I miss you guys so much. You're jealous your chi my child has me as a mom. <laughs> I think it's going to be fun, but I think it's going to be hard. Uh-oh, we've got a dirty diaper. We got a dirty di change diaper. Then she's about to go try for another baby. Oh, she hasn't even nursed yet. She's nursing with the dirty diaper now. Oh, thank you so much, Lispy. That's so nice of you to say. It, it always makes me feel so good when people say that my they... Um, that my videos have helped them and stuff. That's really sweet. I'm glad I can do that. Wait, what? Does she want to have a public woohoo? Yeah, she wants to have a public woohoo with three sims. She does. And she's a knowledge sim. Does she have a secondary? Did we give her a secondary? Where am I going? I don't remember how to play. Why? Where are secondary aspirations? Oh, right there. I forgot where they were, y'all. Seriously, I gotta get I gotta get used to the game again. Um, no, she doesn't. I don't know why she wants to do with three different sims. That's weird. That's weird for a knowledge sim. Good catch on that. <gasps> okay, let's let's go back. Thank you, Joseph, with an F. Thank you for the Prime sub. Thank you for the Tier 1 sub, Michael's Sparkly Socks. Okay, she finished nursing. Now she's going to change the diaper. We're going to put Lance in the crib. And we're going to go over here and try for a baby. He's just patiently... Arrow's just patiently waiting out here. He's patiently waiting for his morning woohoo. <laughs> Sometimes it happens after every public woohoo. That's probably what it what it is then. She's very curious. That's it. She's very curious. She wants to know what might happen if she did a public woohoo. <laughs> With three different guys. <laughs> Thank you, Chelsea Aitley. Thank you for the tier one sub. I got a beg for gift sub from Katarusha. If anybody feels generous in the chat. Okay, we're going to try for a baby. And then they're going to have to take turns going across the street to get cooled off. I took a complete break from all Sims games. Yes, I did. I didn't play any Sims games for six months. <laughs> the sounds they make are so funny. You let all your sims be poly in the test of time challenge and it gets very complex. Long, yeah. Long oh my god, we're zipping through time. <laughs> I got so caught up in long, long man that I didn't realize we were on speed three. Yeah, I got sims burnout real bad. But I'm ready. I'm ready to play again now. Um, there have been times in my life where I've taken like a year off. But I always come back. Always. <laughs> Hello, guys. Okay, so let's get them up. And we're going to send Raven across the street. For, or no, she might be Prego. Let's send Arrow. I keep forgetting their names. He's hungry, too. Crap, we got to feed them. I forgot how to play. Oh, they don't even have a fridge. Wait, yes they do. Yes they do. Um, there's nothing in there. What does he have in his inventory? 
He's got, oh, he's got blueberries. Let's stock the fridge with the blueberries. Blueberries and squash. You haven't touched your sim game files in like a year at this point. Yep. It happens. It happens. We're gonna, I'm gonna stock it with the bass and the squash and the blueberries. And let's have him make some breakfast. I know it's kind of late. But let's go ahead and serve. Oh no, we can't serve lunch. We'll have to do make a group meal of berry oatmeal. Thank you so much, uh, Brit Stop8535. I gotta save game. All right, let's save game. Um, I gotta hydrate. We're doing great, little Simbi. We're all doing great. Okay, how is she doing with her? See, their heat, their uh, hotness level went down, so they're not in danger right now. But she does need hygiene, though. She does. But in the meantime, while he's making some food, let's have her go and fish. And let me check her inventory, too. She also has bass, squash. Oh, she has papayas. Let's sell these papayas. And get some money. Um, so we can start expanding their shed. That's going to be our next priority is to expand the shed so we can get them indoors. And they don't have to sleep outdoors anymore. Thank you so much for the 100 bits, Nate Mays. <laughs> oh, that's cool, Chelsea. Yeah, that's a great idea to update the save file with the pronouns. Yeah, that's a good idea. I haven't even played the game since the pronoun thing got added. Oh, Arrow got a cooking skill point. Good for him. Yes, this whole challenge is on Pleasant Streams on my stream channel. Yeah. All the other episodes are on there if you want to get caught up. And this, this episode will be on there, too. You've played The Sims 2 still obsessively for the past nine months. I know, it's so good. It's so good. All right, look at that sparkly berry oatmeal. And let's have her come over here and join him and eat. <coughs> oh my gosh, y'all. <coughs> Oh, I don't know what I'm choking on. Don't buy my wedding stories. I just bought it. I just bought it like two days ago, Nathan. <laughs> because I wanted to do a video about um, weddings. So I was like, I'm going to check it out. But I haven't played it yet. I, I haven't gotten to it yet, but I went ahead and bought it. But I did read that it had a lot of problems. Rest in peace, huh? Rest in peace. <laughs> it's still pretty glitchy. That is so unfortunate. Like, it's been out for a while. You think they would have fixed it by now. Yeah, you'll have some great reactions for Twitter if I play it, yeah. Very la laggy gameplay, really. Oh, man, that sucks because I really, like, when I was reading the features that came with it, I thought some of that stuff sounds really cool. Like, being able to have a rehearsal dinner and then have, like, your sim of honor. That sounds pretty cool. But, of course, it's Sims 4, so. <laughs> you really need to shower, but you want to watch the stream? You know what I do? I have a little ledge in my shower, and I just put my phone on there. <laughs> I just put my take my phone in the shower with me and put it on the little ledge. Um, okay, let's send her to the bathroom and then I'm gonna have to send her across the street and she can gather some stuff while she's over there. How's the baby doing? How are you, Babio? He's sleeping away. And let's put uh put these leftovers away for later. What are my thoughts on not being able to have a high school out of Copperdale in the new EP? I didn't even know. I didn't even know that. I know nothing about the new... I've hardly looked at the new pack at all. But that sucks. <laughs> and that is some classic Sims 4 BS right there. <laughs> Christina. I know I didn't tell anybody I was going to stream because I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to because I didn't know how my kidney stone was going to be. But I really wanted to stream today. Okay, what are you doing, dude? Let's, uh... 
Oh, you know what? You can take a sponge bath. That's what you can do. Go ahead and take a sponge bath. Do, 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 do. I have some serious reservations about wants and fears from things I've heard since I made my, that video last week. I got some serious reservations, but we'll see. Yeah, he's, uh, he is sunburned and they both are very hot. <laughs> they both are very hot and I am going to send her across the street now. No, she might be prego. I don't want to send her across the street. She's got to stay here. I keep forgetting. Um, uh, we will send him across the street. What am I trying to do? Walk to... I'm like, how do you go somewhere again? <laughs> Walk to community lot. And we'll have her take a sponge bath just to keep her through going. And then we'll have her go fish a little bit. Alright, sh she's gonna go... He's gonna go by himself. Did I click the wrong person? Did I click the wrong person? I did! Oh, no, no, no! Stop, stop, stop! I clicked the wrong person. Um. <laughs> la, 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 la. Why can't he... Am I missing it? Why can't he go? Oh, there it goes. There it is. Okay, that was weird. All right, he's going across the street. She And he's going by himself to the bathing lot. And she is going to take a sponge bath. <laughs> it was because I had a command queued, yeah. I love when the, when the aspiration meter gets filled up. Yeah, it's so satisfying. Oh, thank you, Calico. I appreciate that. Whims, yes, whims are going to be replaced with wants and fears in The Sims 4, yes. That's what they said in the live stream. You're on round five of your rotational custom neighborhood. You can't go back to playing one family. I know, you can't. You get, it's so much fun to play multiple families. At least for me, I can't speak for everybody because sometimes I get comments, like I got a comment the other day on my video and they're like, this looks like so much work the way you play. And I'm like, what? Work? No, it's fun for me. But I'm the kind of person that loves to micromanage and have spreadsheets. And that's just super fun to me. But some people, I think they, you know, they might like playing just one family. But I think most of my viewers probably like to play the way I do. Uh, what are you doing over here, Arrow? You're going to swing. No, we are not here to swing. <laughs> we are not here to swing one way or the other, buddy. Oh, he wants to get soak in the hot tub. So let's get him soak in the hot tub. Although that seems like kind of a bad idea when it's like super hot outside. I can't select this. Oh my god, it's so hard to select that. Get in. Hi, Nikos Tim Nikos 1M. I thought it said Tim. Thank you. I don't know if I said so three minutes ago, but thank you, Maddie 2 k 2 for the Prime sub. Have you ever thought of doing a Sims 4 rotational Let's Play on YouTube? Yes, I have thought about it. I've put a lot of thought into it. <laughs> but I just... I never really got around to it because it's... It's like I'm trying to think of how can I make it fun and entertaining. And it's much harder to do in The Sims 4, but... We'll see. It's it's bland, yeah. And now I'm going to have to redo everything. When this new update comes out, I'm going to have to redo all my Sims 4 guides, my mods list and everything because this wants and fears update is really going to change things. Thank you so much for the prime set, Pina Colada. I know, when you have to think, it's hopeless. I know. That's how I felt. Aw, thanks, pun cake. And thank you for the five months, uh, Prime Resub. I'm glad that you, uh, get to watch my stream after work. <laughs> okay, that's enough hot tubbing, buddy. That's enough hot tubbing. Let's get over here and take a shower. <clears throat> I know everything's gonna break. They said there wasn't gonna be any more B-Box, but we'll see. They said there wasn't gonna be any more B-Box whims. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Horse Rump. You've started recording a Pleasant View Let's Play. Oh, that's awesome, Caleb. 
Do I have any tips? I don't know. Not really. <laughs> Just play the way that is fun to you and people will respond to that, I think. If you're enjoying it, I think people will like it. Thank you so much for the seven months, Undercooked Amethyst. And thank you for the ten months, pancakes, please. I want some pancakes. That sounds good. I well, two people with pancake-related usernames, and now I want some pancakes. I ha yeah, the hot tub is a hot spring. Yeah, the hot tub is a hot spring. Yeah. That's how it's, he that's how it's heated. Okay, so he just got... He didn't really get cooled off, but he got clean. So go use this, and then we're going to have him uh, harvest. Let's gather some coconuts. I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. Some papayas. I let them harvest one time per visit. Uh, thank you so much for the six months, Necomancy. And let me do a hydrate for you. Cheesecake stuffed pancakes. Oh, that sounds so good. I know, I bet shower time in a waterfall would be really nice. I still need to fix the waterfall. I still haven't done that. Look at, who's this? Flint Stone. He's having a good old time over here. Uh-oh. Maple. We'll reset her. Cold drinks! I don't know where Maple was. Have I had any pregnancy cravings? You know what's really weird is I haven't. Um, it, during the first trimester, I wanted, I craved, I guess I did kind of crave fruit. I just wanted fruit all the time. But I haven't really had any specific ones. But I had aversions. I had really bad aversions. Like, I couldn't eat any kind of meat in the first trimester. Almost everything grossed me out unless it was, like, toast or bagel. <laughs> like, all I could eat was simple carbs. And I even got an aversion to our dishwashing liquid. Like Dawn dishwasher, dishwashing detergent, the smell made me almost vomit every time I went in the kitchen. We had to change dishwasher, dishwashing detergent because I couldn't stand the smell of Dawn. And I was like, that's so weird. I didn't know you could get aversions to just like smells of random things. Uh, no, Satrina, I didn't. I had to stop taking my medication for my hair when I got pregnant because it can cause birth defects. But I think being pregnant made my hair grow better, so it was a trade-off. Okay, where are you, dude? It's time for you to go back home. Did we gather everything? Do I, do I have coconuts, papayas, and is that all we had? Yeah, I think that's all. I thought we had three different trees. Did we only have two different trees? Okay, I guess we only had two. Couldn't stand the smell of Don Lothario. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go home. Wait, how do I go home? Walked a lot. That's how. Uh, thank you so much, Kate Lily Mangoes, for the tier one sub. And thank you for the nine months anxious possum. <laughs> yeah, but I've, I'm going to go back on it after the baby's born just as a precaution, probably. Go back on my medicine. I didn't get any of the new kits. No, I looked at them and I was like, mm -mm. <laughs> I didn't want any of them. I didn't get any of them. I was like, none of those look like they're worth $5 to me. So <laughs> did you guys get any of them? You know, Caleb, I don't know what we're going to do about the nursery. Um, because now I had to set all my equipment up, back up to stream and make videos again. And it takes up half of the room that we were going to make into our bedroom. So, like, I don't know what we're going to do now. We have to figure out some way to turn two bedrooms into a nursery, our bedroom, and a studio for my streaming. So, we need a bigger house. But God knows nobody can afford to move right now. Jesus Christ. The housing market in our area, like, we can't afford anything. We couldn't even afford this house if we didn't already have it. You got the build kits because you're a decorator. Yeah, I can see that. For the stuff, yeah. You like the little campers kit? Yeah, that was the one I was thinking about. Was the little campers. <laughs> With your help, you can buy Cindy a new house. Subscribe today. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Don't put my baby in the toilet or under the sink. <laughs> I'll try to remember that. 
<laughs> okay, Raven, let's see. Let's check on the babby over here. If he's he's still sleeping away, so I'm going to have her go do some fishing. Try to catch some more bass for us so we have uh, food here. Millennial and Gen Z struggles. I know it. I know. I feel grateful that we have the house we have and we're going to make the most of it. We're going to make the most of it. <laughs> Can I get a free 20K, please? Free 20K handout. We'll just move into the sim bin and we'll get 20K. <laughs> I wish that's what life was really like. I know. Some sm I need some smart milk. Yeah, I need some smart milk for my baby. <laughs> Why does America have the no handout bot? I don't know. <laughs> the sim bin would be nicer. For some people, it would. <laughs> I modded that out. I modded that out of... Now, if that was in real life, there's no way I would mod that out. <laughs> Millennial struggles, but at least we got The Sims 2. That's our comfort in these trying times. Uh, thank you so much for the 100 bits, JD. And thank you for the five months, Daniel Pleasant. Oh, we got Daniel Pleasant in here, y'all. <laughs> thank you. It's been a while since I've been on Twitch, too. What are you doing? I told you to fish. I didn't tell you to sleep. Get over here and fish. <laughs> Thank you for that clip, Nathan. Oh, hello. It's Nut, y'all. It's Nut. <laughs> nuts over here showing his nuts. <laughs> hello, Nut Tiny Leaf. <laughs> hello there. He's just walking by. He's just passing through, y'all. He's passing through. <laughs> his fig leaf. <laughs> Cover yourself, nut. You're trying to get an apartment for your fiance and you, and it's a struggle. Yeah, it is. It's a struggle everywhere. I just can't believe it. There's a house on our street. It's selling for, like, double what it sold for when the people bought it, like, a couple years ago. And I'm like, that house is not worth that much. <laughs> I don't know what's happening over here. He has two fig leaves. <laughs> That's more than some people can afford. That's right. Is she not catching any fish, y'all? We need some more. She does have one bass and one yellow squash. Do I hear the baby crying? Yep. Okay. That's enough fishing. Let's go take care of the child. Your new name is Mike Truck. <laughs> oh, that is funny. Okay, okay. We're coming. We're coming. Oh, she was already coming to nurse him. I'm just going to let her instincts take over. She wanted to come nurse him, so. Yeah, I get my training done already. I know. That's how I prepared myself for having a baby is playing The Sims. <laughs> when I was in the first trimester and I was really sick and everything, Andrew was like, he looked at me one day and he goes, now I see why The Sims, uh, why the Sims needs are always going down so fast when they're pregnant. <laughs> like, yeah, it's true. It's true. Sleeve McNichol. All right, she's nursing. Let's speed up the nursing a little bit. She's really hot, y'all. I wonder if she can take a sponge bath to cool down. Maybe that's why she stopped. I was forcing her to fish, and she was over here having a heat stroke. <sighs> the pee need. Yeah, I have to pee constantly. I have to pee. Oh, oh, yeah, I meant to tell you guys. I might have to take a pee break in this stream. Like, the baby's right on my bladder. Yeah. Will I name the new boo Melba? No. No, I will not. I will not name my baby Melba. Okay, let's change his diaper. Change his diaper. And give him a little cuddle. Put him back in the crib. Oh, she cooled off just from being inside the hut. Oh. Arrow was back. Arrow was back. Let's sell what he got. Because they don't really eat the papayas or coconuts right now. We're just kind of using those for money. <clears throat> so that we can expand the hut. They have 282 now. What is he doing? Oh, he's going to clean up the diaper. How sweet. Your nose is on fire. Are you sick? 
My uh, mic keeps like sl sliding down slowly. Man, what are you two doing? They're gonna go have some romance. Aww. She's like, I missed you while you were har out harvesting today. Um, I'm gonna have her take another sponge bath because she's getting kind of grungy. Oh no, help with birthday! Oh, help with birthday! We got a toddler, y'all! We got a toddler! Oh my gosh, yay! We can finally see what he's gonna look like! Oh wow, look at this kid! Let's go into tab. Look at him! That's so cute! He is cute, isn't he cute? That's an adorable kid. I think he, I think he definitely looks more like his dad. He's got his mom's eyes though. He's definitely got his mom's eyes. At least the color. Where's the dad? Come here, you. Let's... Where are you? Wait, where are you? Oh. 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 What? What? Oh. <laughs> yeah. He looks like the dad. He looks like the dad. I think. I don't know. Oh, yeah. I forgot about our garden. Oh, crap. The name of the hair that she has? Oh gosh, I don't know. I don't remember. Does anybody know what hair that is? I don't remember what hair that is. Maybe somebody in chat can tell you. It, yeah, it went inside of him. That's a cute kid though. That's a really cute kid. They made a cute kid. That garden can live for six days without water? Oh, awesome, Nathan. Uh, thank you so much for the 10 months of BPOS 312. I'm glad to be back. Thank you. And thank you, Danny Lax, for the 13 months. Oh, I got another hydrate. I'm almost done with my glass, y'all. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and water and tend the garden. Since he's got a little energy left in him. He probably needs to eat. So what I'm going to have him do is water the garden... Oh, we can harvest. We got blueberry. Let's get a basket of blueberries. And I'm going to have her put the baby down. Let's check on him. Oh, we haven't even checked on his personality or anything, y'all. So he is a an Aries. He's a popularity. He's a pop. I remember. I remember my zodiac signs. Uh, will I be continuing Pleasant Sims? Pleasant View, the next generation. Um, I think I will. Yeah, I think I will. I think I'm ready to get back. I think I'm right now I'm playing Fabian and Kevin and I kind of really miss them. <laughs> and let's see, he's very, very outgoing, y'all. He's super outgoing. He's so handsome. And he is uh, very serious. He's very serious though. He likes entertainment, although that doesn't really matter. And we, you know what? Now we're gonna have to get some more stuff for him too. So they're not even gonna be able to expand all his needs are good. All his needs are good. So let's just have her put him down. And we need a potty chair. What all do we need? Oh, I did change the zodiacs, didn't I? I think Ari I still changed. I think Aries is still. I don't remember what I changed him to. Hold on. Aries is romance now in my new system. I forgot I did a new system right before I left. Aries is romance now. Thank you. Thank you for reminding me of my own rules. <laughs> uh, oh, thanks so much, Blossom Blitz, on congratulating me on the pregnancy. Thank you. And thank you, uh, Spazzed Out Mess, for 11 months. And thank you for uh, one tier one sub, Heritage Nomad. And thank you for the 100 bits. Sir Istikin? <laughs> I don't know how to say your name. Ristikinat. <laughs> I don't know how you're supposed to say that. I will turn comments back on on my website, yeah. Now that I'm going to be able to manage them again. Yes, I will. Okay. Do I know the gender? 
of my baby? I'm having a girl. I'm having a girl. Yeah, but it's a good it's a good time to save. Thank you. Um I probably will get the new expansion pack for Sims 4 just so I can review it for you guys. And thank you so much for the Prime sub. No, what was that? Yeah, Prime sub. Person whose name I can't say. <laughs> thank you. All right, so we're going to put Lance down and we're going to buy... Oh, look, does she want to potty train him? Okay, I like that better than fishing, fishing badge. We're going to lock that in. And we are going to... Wait, what? Fire? Oh, she burned the berry oatmeal. We're going to get the things that we need. So we need a pot. We need a potty chair, obviously. And I'm going to put that over here by the regular turlet. Name their baby Brittany. <laughs> That's a good idea. Oh, you're doing random aspirations? Yeah, some people do do that. And thank you for the 200 bits, Megamatic. And thank you for the 95 bits. It's Sammy19. And then, you know what? Let's get him a little toy. And I'm going to get him the little in the little play set. Okay, I'm going to put that right outside the shack. And I think that's, like, really all we need right now. Do, 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 do. And let's put him down. Does he have to potty at all? No, not at all. She just changed his diaper, so... He wants he wants to be held by his mama. Aww. <laughs> no, Cindy is not short for Cynthia. I am just Cindy. I am just Cindy. Okay, and wait, what were you trying to do? Oh, I was gonna have her go take another sponge bath before she got busy. We got another basket basket of blueberries. And he's hungry, so I'm going to let him eat some porridge. Oh, the new Sims 4-pack will have teen-only aspirations? Well, that's kind of nice. It's kind of about time for that. Hello, Anathi06. Uh, Bella and Morty are doing great. They are doing great. Same old, same old with them. Gibbons is doing really well. He has not had any more problems since he had his surgery. I, did, I have not played the werewolf thing at all, either. The werewolf pack. And I'm going to check on the baby one more time, and I think I'm going to have her go ahead and go lay down. And I guess she didn't get prego, y'all. We'll have to try again tomorrow. That's too bad. Um, no, I don't ever worry about the dogs going missing because we have a, fi a fully fenced-in backyard and we only let them out in the back. And it's like, it's, it's locked down tight. Like, they can't get out. What are my feelings on the goth refresh? I have no knowledge of that. Did they already do it? I have been out of the loop of The Sims 4 for months. <laughs> Um, I do plan to get the werewolf pack, and I do plan to talk about it after I get it. So I do plan to let you guys know what I think about it, but I just haven't done it yet. No, we're planning on staying in our current house right now because we just can't afford to move anywhere. Everything's too expensive. Like, the only thing we can afford is, like, the most run-down dump ever. I just realized that I was- I am not showing my subs. <laughs> I was sitting on the sub display. I think I just pulled- oh crap, I think I just pulled my headphones out. Do I like the look of the werewolves? To be honest, not really. <laughs> but I haven't seen m that much of them to be- oh my god, I just ripped it out again. There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's check in on the baby. What's she getting up for? Oh no, she's having a heat stroke, y'all! Oh crap! She's having a heat stroke. I'm so sorry. Can does it get it? Go get a drink. Go get a drink. 
Go get a drink for that's what I should have been doing. You think the Bella and Morty makeovers are fine, but you don't know about the other two? I haven't seen them. Did they already do it? She's too hot to sleep. Been there. Yeah, me too. Bye, Vampire Kitten. Thanks for stopping by. Gotta hydrate. <laughs> they did? Okay, then I have to go look. I had no idea. <clears throat> I have to go look at that. Alright, she- Hopefully this drink- Okay, that drink cooled her down. She's gonna use the bathroom. Let me- I don't know what I just did. Come here. Try and check on the baby. And then let's have her, uh, try to potty train him. Uh-oh. Do we have another heat stroke on her hands? Aw, oh, crap. Aw, oh, crap. Oh, they made Bella's boobs smaller? <laughs> what? A, why am I clicking all over the place? Alright, I'm gonna have her potty train Lance, and we need to have him come get a drink. This summer has been rough. This summer has been really rough on my sims. The baby's okay. The baby's okay so far. I'm gonna get her to potty train him. Maybe. Maybe. And let's get him. We have to get him to stop playing with the toy. Take a break to check it out so we can see your reaction live. Okay, we'll do it at the end of the stream. I'll do it. I'll go look at him. And we'll see. Uh, thanks so much, Elite Panther 4, for the two-month resub. Thank you. <laughs> it, you know, you know, you already know I'm not going to be happy unless they look just like they do in The Sims 2. <laughs> if they don't look like they do in The Sims 2, I'm not going to be happy. There's no such thing as the prehistoric social worker, no. I think I modded that out. If I didn't, I should have. Okay, you take a sponge bath, and then you need to go back to sleep. And then we need to take care of her because she needs to eat. She needs to eat. <laughs> Thank you, Darkalato. Thank you so much. I'm glad to be back. Uh, thanks for the four-month prime sub, Nate Mays. Thank you for the prime sub, McKay all day. Thank you very much. You already know I'm going to hate them. <laughs> I don't have high hopes, I'll tell you that. Oh, I miss my Edgewood too. I, I kind of want to work on that again too. Did I get everybody? I did. Let's check on the baby. Okay, the baby needs to go to sleep. She fell asleep in her food. Maybe she is prego. I'm just gonna try to get a few bites in her and then we'll have her go put the baby down. <laughs> the Tasha Go Hate Club! Well, I love Tasha Go, so I can't join. <laughs> I love her! How can you hate Tasha? Edge was the reasons you have reason you have four custom I was actually working on another custom neighborhood. Cause I wanted to like every time I feel like I can do it better, you know? Okay, she really needs to go put the baby up. I know you're so oh, is he gonna wake dad up? Is he gonna wake his dad up? We should just have dad do it. We'll just have dad do it. We need to get her in bed. Just come come go to sleep. I tried to get her to eat, but Flop should go. <laughs> okay, well somebody just go to sleep. <laughs> go to sleep. There you go. I mean, yeah, it's true. I do like Meadow and Ivy better than Tasha, but I still like her. Uh, thanks so much for gifting a sub. I'm just going to call you Srist. <laughs> Thank you for gifting a sub to Guto Simmer. 
Okay, everybody's asleep now. Let's save. Okay, that's fine. Okay, good. <laughs> and we're just gonna get through the get through the morning with them. Although I am worried about her. She's getting really hungry. Let's you know what? Let's wake her up and have her go eat. Empty, no. Let's wake her up and have her go finish eating this uh oatmeal. I'm worried about her hunger levels there. Oh, she is! She is! She's fresh. She's pregnant. We're getting another baby. Oh, I should have done a prediction, y'all. I should have done a prediction, and I forgot. Icky Ricky, yeah. Okay, let's check on little Lance. He's fine. He just wants to get out. Um, we'll have your dad let you out. How come I can't let him out? Oh. Let Lance out, and she needs to go get some comfort, and she needs to go back to sleep. <laughs> no twins, no! But we won't get to see that baby till next time, because we're about to move on to the next family. But at least we have a baby coming, another baby coming. Yeah, pregnant Sims can, can too die. In The Sims 2, yeah, they will die of starvation. <laughs> yes, they will. That's what I like about The Sims 2. Consequences. They can without mods. In Sims 2. You don't even need mods. They'll just die. I remember I had uh, Jennifer Burb die. Like, one of the first times that I played Pleasant View. And I didn't know Sims could die. Pregnant Sims could die. Oh, yeah. They'll drop dead. <laughs> Had Johnny marry his mom once. Ew. <laughs> okay, what's he doing? Oh, he's changing that out. And the kid's alright, but we'll go ahead and try to potty train him again. You want to buy a bathtub, you silly thing. You can't buy a bathtub. <laughs> okay, well, you could have done that first. You could have thrown that away first. Wait, what happened to my subs thing? Like, why are my subs... Oh, there they go. <laughs> the second baby Spears is going to pop out of the womb saying, It's Brittany, bitch! <laughs> <sighs> we have to name her Brittany if it's a girl. I mean, we just have to. <laughs> Hit me, baby, one more time. Yeah, the agony of pregnant Sims. Too tired to eat, too hungry to sleep. It's a bad cycle to get into. You've had Jennifer Burb die while pregnant, too? Yeah, she died from hunger for me, too. And I was like, what? I didn't know they could die? <laughs> Good for you, Lance. Good job. He's got bad hygiene, but there's nothing we can do about that. You're just going to be a stinky boy. And, okay, it's 6.40 a.m., so I think we can go ahead and switch. I'm going to save, and let's go check out our next family. I'm only playing one day at a time, right? Is that right? I think I was playing one day at a time. Somebody tell me if I was wrong. I don't remember my own rules. And I gotta fill up my water now. Nope, not in Sims 2, they're not. In Sims 2, they can die. I gotta drink this whole thing today. Yeah, this is a three liters. Three liter bottle. Oh my god. <clears throat> I was playing a season! Ah, oh, crap! Okay, we're not switching. We're not switching yet. Thank you. I should have. I really. I guess I should have really looked over the rules before I started playing. But I thought I would remember, and I didn't. <laughs> Predictions. Okay. Yes. So she will have the baby. Yeah, she will have it. Okay. Let's do a prediction. Let's do. We're 
We're going to do uh, gender or baby. Oh, that was my last prediction. Okay, boy or girl. And I'm going to make it for... We'll make it for 15 minutes, or we'll make it for 10 minutes. You can put in your, your votes for 10 minutes. All right. There it goes. Predict. Put in your predictions. And thank you so much for the two months, Becca. Thank you so much. And uh, a question, I gotta ask me anything. Oh, no question, but just wanted to see, say you missed me. Aw, I missed you too. <laughs> Thank you, Spotty B. I mean, they'll probably, they'll eventually have a girl. You know, even if it's not this one, they will eventually have one. I am doing great. Thank you. <laughs> Bob or grill. <laughs> yes, that's what I mean. No, the Discord's not going to come back. It's not. I'm sorry. Oh, look how cute. He's playing with him. Um, You should see a little thing at the top of your chat that says predict at the top of your chat box. You can click on that. That's where it shows up for me anyways. Um, Okay, you need to get some breakfast. Let's feed the baby too. Oh, I can't feed him. That's right. He has to be nursed. Okay, just put him down. And go eat your porridge. You can't use channel points? I see your prediction, Mel. Gregfist. <laughs> Yeah, they just stay constantly sunburnt because they can't even. They we need to make their their uh. We need to make their hut bigger so they can go inside. Maybe I should have them rest in here. Maybe that would help them. Because of your region. Hmm. It shows you predicted girl. Yeah, some countries are banned because people they think people are gambling, which is really weird. Thank you so much, uh, Dina25, for the tier one sub. Thank you. <laughs> eat that, eat that porridge. I'm going to check in on her. Oh, she's up now. She's up, she's over here gardening. Let's see. The garden looks fine. You can harvest a basket of blueberries. And then we're going to have her go to the bathroom and get something to eat. And does the kid need to be potty trained? No, he's fine. Then we'll have her take a sponge bath. I see yours, uh, Citrina. I see you that you predicted girl. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you have to refresh or something. I don't know. I can see your predictions. Uh, um, there's no backstory on the family, really, because this is a challenge, so... The only thing that's happened is they've had one child and they're about to have another. And they're we're we're living in prehistoric times. This is a test of time challenge. So they're just, this family's new. They're just starting out. <laughs> I seem calmer. <laughs> I'm tired from pregnancy. It's mellowed me out. I thank you so much for the twelve months, Lyheart Fox, and thank you for the eight months of raisin and sneakers. <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad to be back. <sighs> Ow. Ah, I think my kidney stone is moving. It hurts. I seem at peace. I am much more at peace. I am. Like, once I found out I was uh, going to have a baby, like, everything in my life... My perspective on things changed a lot. She's gonna have a heat stroke. Like what I feel is important in life has changed a lot. Let's have her get a drink. I think it's moving out. I do. I think it's I think it's on its way out. Oh, thank you, Odie Odie Leiden, for giving out two gift subs. Thank you so much for giving gift subs to Pleasant Re and Paranoid Android. Thank you. 
<laughs> oh, thank you for the uh, thank you for congratulating me on ninety thousand subscribers. I can't believe I got ninety thousand subscribers on YouTube, y'all. I never thought I would get that many. <laughs> so that's awesome. Aw, thank you. I appreciate you saying that. I think I'm going to be a good mom, too. I'm going to do the best I can, anyway. Alright, time to save. Britney Spears is the biggest pop star, star of the prehistoric era. How is Bobby formed? How girl get pregnant? She threw up. She's got morning sickness, poor thing. Not Don't name the baby Jamie Lynn. I won't. <laughs> I won't. <laughs> okay, now let's see. Okay, yeah. Oh, 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 oh! We're about to get the bat bump. Bump, bump, bump. Oh, why is she wearing that? Why are you wearing modern pajamas all of a sudden? I thought I replaced the pajamas. Yeah, we need to roll the pacifier. That's a very good point. That's a very good point. We need to do that right now. Thank you for reminding me. I forgot all about it. I still don't have the launcher, the Sims 2 launcher thing that fixes this. I still don't have it. Uh, what's wrong with me? Fix re-randomized Sim Generator. I'm gonna do that real quick. Uh, thank you so much, Tyranny Crowned, for the three-month Prime sub. And thank you for the three months, uh, Melalyn. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, you're going to set up a storyline for your test of time. That's a good idea. I like that. <laughs> That's outfit. That outfit's prehistoric, like the 80s. That makes me feel old as hell. I was born in the 80s. <laughs> I was born in the early 80s. <laughs> I love the 80s. I love the 80s aesthetic. Right now, I'm watching Stranger Things 4 right now. It's so good. Oh my god, it's so good. I think this is the best season yet, y'all. Have you guys watched it? Don't spoil it for me, because I'm only on, like, episode 4 or something. Thank you so much for the 300 bits, Anonymous. Thank you. You thought I was born in 97? I was born in 83. <laughs> you loved it, too? It's so good. <laughs> I was like, I don't even remember the other seasons being this good. My favorite tale. Am I hooked by Kate Bush? Yeah, I always liked Kate Bush. So that's, I think it's pretty cool. That people are uh, discovering that. That song, I love that song too. That they keep playing. Stranger Things is so good. It's like the best thing Netflix has ever done. Okay, so we did that, and we, she really needs to take a sponge bath. I don't want to send her to the bathing lot because she's prego and it messes up their time. <laughs> Stranger Things made you love the 80s, and you're 20 years old. That's awesome. 2001, 2005. Y'all are so young. <laughs> Enjoy your youth. In 97, I was like... I was in the prime of my life in 1997. <laughs> 2002. I see. There, there's a 93. <laughs> That's the young. Oh, 87. 80s gang. <laughs> 1953. Oh, that's awesome. 70s? I see two 70s. I see two 70s. I see some 80s. You're a Gen Z. My, I just realized that my daughter is going to be Gen, Generation Alpha. There's a new generation after Gen Z coming up, y'all. Think about that. That's crap. I'm like two generations back now. I'm a millennial. I am a millennial. Okay, let's check. Oh, Lance learned a skill. Thank you so much for the six month. Izzy Bambi, thank you. I'm not a boomer, damn it! <laughs> uh, let's check on the kid. Alright, he needs some food. We're gonna have to have her go nurse him. I know she needs fun, but you know what? See, now she's wearing a decent outfit. 
Wait, how can I feed him? I can't nurse him now that he's a toddler. Oh, get bottle for Lance. I have to get, I forgot I have to get it out of the fridge. Jesus. Yeah, this is a challenge. This is a test of time challenge. Gotta fix my mic again. I gotta get a better mic stand, y'all. <laughs> I'm not even close to a boomer. My older brother is Gen X. And then I'm a millennial. I could get a dog bowl again. Yeah, I could. I could do that. Somebody needs to go across the street and harvest. Let's send dad back across the street. Oh, he's working on the garden. Thank you. Um, Let's send him. We need to go harvest again so we can get some more money. Your kids are both Zoomers. <laughs> I don't know when the millennial cutoff is. I don't know when the last year. Well, I, don't, I really didn't. I got to ask me anything. Hey, Cindy, how did you decide to come back to social media? I may have cried a little bit when you left. <laughs> Thank you. Um, well, I to me, like I didn't decide to come back to social media. I'm only back to YouTube and Twitch. Because I love my channel and I love doing this. I love streaming. I love making videos. What I don't love is Twitter. <laughs> what I don't love is, is how, like, I don't like social media. I think social media is a cancer on society. I think it's a scourge. So I will not be back to Twitter or Discord or anything like that. I'm only back on YouTube and Twitch. But it's because I missed it and I love doing this. 99 is still a millennial? What? That doesn't sound right. <laughs> Best shows I watched during my time off. Oh, I watched a lot of stuff. What did I watch? Oh, I watched the whole... You know what? He needs to go take a shower before he overheats. I watched the entire nine seasons of The Middle. Have you guys ever seen that show, The Middle? I love it so much. It's so good. And uh, that's kind of what made me want to have a kid again, is watching that show. I was like, I want a family! <laughs> Millennial ends in 96. Yeah, er when I got off Twitter, it improved my mental health so much. Yeah. It's just cesspit over there. It's a cesspit. I hate it. People have added the Maxis Townies to all of Meet Me to the Rivers Clean templates. Oh, that's awesome. That's great news. I love that. I'm going to have to check that out. You love the middle too? Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad I see some people love in the middle. I was, And we just finished it like two days ago. And I've been watching it for months. And I was like so sad. I always feel like a loss when a show I like is over, you know? Can I change my username on Twitch? Oh, can you change your username on Twitch? I think so. You should be able to, Caleb. I'm not exactly sure where you go, but I think I'm pretty sure you can. Did I like the ending? I did, and I loved how they showed the future in the ending of the middle. I loved it. I was so happy that they did that. Um, that they showed, like, the future of the kids and everything. That was really cool. If they wouldn't have done that, I probably wouldn't have been as satisfied. You're considering leaving Twitter. Yeah, it's you will. You're not missing anything. If you leave Twitter, you're just gaining better mental health. That's what I think. I watched an episode. This is so timely, y'all, because I watched an episode of Black Mirror last night. Do any of you guys watch Black Mirror on Netflix? It's so good. Um, but I think this was in the second season and it was the episode about the Twitter hashtag. Tell me if you know what I'm talking about. I don't want to spoil it if you haven't seen it. But if you're thinking about leaving Twitter, <laughs> go watch. It's called Hate Most Hated in the Nation or something like that. Go watch that if you're thinking about leaving Twitter. It might convince you. <laughs> you still got Tumblr. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tumblr can be kind of bad, too, sometimes. But it's a good way to find custom content, so I'll probably keep it, too. <laughs> I 
Yeah, Tumblr just shows you who you follow. That's right. That's what makes it better. It's it's kind of easier to control what you see, you know? Yeah. I deleted my Twitter. All of my... God, I don't even know how many followers. I had a bunch of followers on Twitter. And I deleted it. <laughs> now, there is a Pleasant Sims Twitter, and I do own the Pleasant Sims Twitter, but I don't have anything on there. I just I just got it again so that nobody could take my name because I didn't want anybody to try to impersonate me or anything. So I just claimed the account the account again, but I don't I don't post on it or go on it. It has nothing on it. So I know some people have followed me on there and you you are following me, but I'm not I just don't do anything on there. <laughs> okay. So let's see. What am I doing with this guy? He took did he take a shower? He's still hot. Did he take- I don't even- I wasn't even paying attention if he took a shower. Yeah, I don't really go on Instagram anymore. I do have a personal Instagram, but I just post on there very irregularly. Very infrequently. Uh, thank you for the prime sub, Duda Dudas. <laughs> but Instagram- I don't find Instagram to be nearly as bad, yeah. If you're on there for sim stuff, you can just see sim stuff. It's it's really easy to control it. It's just, I don't know. I'm just not into social media. He did shower and he's still not cooling off, y'all. I don't know what to do for him. Let's have him gather. Gather some coconuts. Gather some papayas. We'll send him back home. We can get some water. No, I've never tried the Not So Berry Challenge. I don't really know what it is. I mean, I've heard of it, but I don't really know what it entails. <laughs> yeah, he needs to drink water, but there's no water for him here to drink. <laughs> Was I ever on MySpace? Oh, yeah. That's how I met Andrew. That's how I met my husband. Well, that, well I met him when he delivered pizza to me. But he contacted me on MySpace after that, and that's how, like, we started talking. Is there a reason I got rid of Clean UI Mod? Um, I just like, I just like the, uh, classic one better. I, and then I'll get tired of it and I'll change to Clean UI, I don't know, I just switch them back and forth when I feel like it. <laughs> the thing about MySpace was... Remember when you used to have your top eight friends? You used to put, you used to have to rank your friends in order of who was the best, and that would cause so much drama, y'all. Because people, because every time like one of your friends would start dating somebody and they put that person number one, and you'd be like, "What? I'm not your number one best friend anymore." Now that you're seeing this dude, <laughs> did I have any cringe usernames? Not really. At least I don't think I did. <laughs> I, I wasn't like Angel Rock 69 XXX. No, I would never do anything like that. <laughs> uh, okay, Arrow, it's time for you to go home. You've had enough fun. Go back and go back to your wife and child. Uh, no, no, no. Walk home. That way we can sell your stuff. How did I come up with Pleasant Sims? When I was starting to make my YouTube channel, I wanted, I was only planning on doing pleasant, a Pleasant View Let's Play. Like, I had no ambitions for my channel to go the way it did or to get popular or anything. I just wanted to make a Sims Pleasant View Let's Play. That was my only plan for my YouTube channel. And so I, I was going to do Pleasant View Sims, but it was already taken. So I just did Pleasant Sims. <laughs> That's how it came about. Okay, I know you're super hot. I know you're so hot. Let's go get you a glass of water. It's so hard to keep them cool. I think I'm gonna have her rest over here in the shelter. But let's check. Oh, the baby needs. The baby needs things. He's stinky. Your cringy MySpace name was Bright White Angel. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. <laughs> You you had an emo username, XX Chibi Pasta XX, <laughs> the X the capital X and the little X at the beginning and the end. Yeah, that really that's really telling. <laughs> that tells you what era that was from. 
I don't think I ever, I think my username was just like Cindy 500 or something. Like, I don't think I did anything like that. That I remember. No, go potty train Lance, please. Let's potty train this baby. Yeah, and I resisted MySpace for a while. I resisted it for a while. I don't think I got one until 2007. It was a year before I met Andrew. Um, I got a MySpace because my friends were like, you gotta get a MySpace. I was like, okay. And then I remember I had my roommate at the time. We went out into this field besides our, beside our apartment complex and he took pictures of me for my MySpace profile. It was like, <laughs> posing by a tree or something on a digital camera that, like a shitty little digital camera that you had to plug into the computer with the USB cord. <laughs> um, how long after meeting did Andrew and I get together? Immediately. Like immediately. Well, he delivered pizza to me in December. And he sent me a message on MySpace, like in December, but I didn't check my MySpace very often. I didn't see his message until January. So then when I got the message in January, then I started talking to him. And like, we started talking on the phone probably like the next day. And then we like went out on a date like the next week and we were talking on the phone every day. And we just like immediately, it was just like immediate connection, like an immediate, we just clicked together immediately. And we've never been apart since then for 15 years. <laughs> Thank you so much uh, for the tier one sub, Tyler Ames. Yeah, thankfully my friend talked me into MySpace, yes. <laughs> yeah, when you used to have to carry your phone, digital camera, and MP3 player. Oh, I remember those days. I remember, I remember saying out loud, I think I said this to Andrew, I was like, I am never going to put my music on a phone. I want to have a separate MP3 player and a separate phone. Why would you want both of them together in one? <laughs> like, I didn't, I couldn't get it. I couldn't grasp it. And then, like, once smartphones became, like, really popular and everybody had smartphones, I was like, oh, yeah, this is way better. What the hell was I thinking? I still have an MP3 player. I still have my MP3 player, y'all. I do. I found it the other day. Where I, I found it in this drawer, I swear to God. <gasps> Here it is. <laughs> this is from like. Oh, this is old. That's it. That's what you used to have to carry around. You have to load all your music on here as MP3s. Does it turn on? Uh, I think it's dead. It says power hold. It's dead. It's long dead. This thing is literally from like 12 years ago. Your dad still has his Zune? <laughs> I never had an iPod. That was a Sony that I had. And I, re I think it has green. Like the screen has like green text on it. Okay, Raven, let's see. What are we going to do about you? Your baby stinks and he's exhausted. He won't go to the bathroom. So let's just put him in the crib for now. And let's have you go re go lounge under here. And let's see if that cools her off. I used to have a, a Discman. A Sony Discman. If you don't know what that is, it is a portable CD player. And I remember I used to listen to all my Rob Zombie CDs on that. <laughs> When I was a teenager. I, I remember specifically that I had a Rob Zombie CD and I had a Sublime and a Nirvana CD that I used to listen to on my Discman. I used to take it to school with me and then when I would walk home from school I would listen to it. Did she cool off? No, she needs a drink. Sorry it's so hot. Slam in the back of my Dragula. That was the first concert I ever went to. It was Rob Zombie. And it was awesome when I was 16. And that was the Dragula uh, era, too. Of Rob Zombie. It was really cool. 
You had a Celine Dion tape in your cassette player on loop because it's all your... Yeah, I remember those days when you only had, like, you only had whatever your parents would buy for you. Tapes and CDs. So that was all you would listen to. It wasn't like today, man. Kids have it so good today where you can just go on Spotify, listen to... Or YouTube. Listen to whatever you want to. Find all kinds of new music. Not in my day, I tell you. We had to listen to whatever mom would buy us from the store. <laughs> Yeah, Rob Zombie did put on. It was a great show. I would go to a Rob Zombie show today. We're old. We're old as hell. We're we're old. My first CD, my first CD was the Aladdin soundtrack. <laughs> the Ala the Disney animated movie Aladdin. Arabian nights, like Arabian days. I used to listen to that all the time. <laughs> That's my first CD. When I was like 10 or 11. <laughs> you saw Rob before the pandemic? Oh, that's awesome. Those hit clips things? I don't remember. I don't know what that is. It's The name sounds... I don't know what that is. She is over here just harvesting away, even though she's about to have a heat stroke. Oh, look, Dad's back. Uh, let's let let's let him take over the gardening so she can rest. Uh, why don't you go harvest <clears throat> that? And you go use the bathroom. You know what? I wonder if we could put a chair in here. No, we can't even afford a chair. We need 211. Oh, let's sell what he got. Let's sell all of this stuff and then maybe we can buy a chair and put it inside and they can take turns sitting inside and getting cool. Yes, let's do that. And we'll have her go to the bathroom and then come sit. Do people still buy CDs? Yeah, they do. Well, I have a whole bunch of CDs. That I bought from, we have like a used record store here and they sell CDs, tapes, records. And so I just buy CDs. I don't know why. I don't even have a CD player. I don't even have a CD player, but I have like this whole collection of like 90 CDs. Your first CD was Avril Lavigne. <laughs> ACDC. <clears throat> yeah, I like having physical media too. I have record CDs. I don't have any tapes, though. You get out of here. That's not for you. That chair's not for you. The baby's asleep. He went all the way in there just to say the baby smells bad. You're supposed to be... Just... I'm gonna have you tend. Just go tend to this. I have Spotify Premium, too, but I still buy CDs. They're like collector's editions to me. Kids Bop. I remember Kids Bop. Yes, I do. Can you harvest that? No. <laughs> we don't we can still play DVDs in our PlayStation, I think. Ow. 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 He's like, hey baby, you stink. I think I was too old for Kids Bop. Like when it started coming out, I think I was like a preteen and I thought that was I thought I was too old for it. <laughs> they still make Kids Bop. I remember when there used to be like um compilation CDs, you know? I would have all of the uh Punkaramas. All the Punkarama CDs. <laughs> <gasps> Your friend's going to a kids' bop concert? Really? That's a thing. Hello, Plum Bob Girl. Now that's what I call music. Volume 21. <laughs> yes! Remember, I remember those too. Uh-oh, baby's awake. Baby's awake. Uh, oh, he needs to go to the bathroom. Let's see. Let's have... 
Oh my god, where, where is she? Oh, she's asleep. I thought she passed out on the ground. I'm gonna see if we can get the kid to the turret, but I don't think we're gonna make it in time. Why do you not put that in there? Nope, it's too late. It's too late! We'll see if we can change his diaper. What do I think of Adele? I love Adele. She's got a beautiful voice. Um, I can't do anything. You're gonna we're gonna have to wait till you crap yourself, kid. We're gonna have to wait till you absolutely crap yourself. I'm really worried about her. She's very, very hot. She's prego. She needs she's tired, and that's why she won't go in here. I wonder if we can pull this out. Let's see. Because if we could make this one bigger, we could get the bench in here. Actually, you know what? We can get the bench in here now. Let's, let me get her. I think we can get the bench in here now. If we put the crib here, we could put the, oh no, it's not going to work. Not going to work. Okay. No, I don't play any instruments myself. I don't have the discipline. Um, Andrew plays guitar though. We don't have enough. What is this? We don't need that. Let's sell that. We sell the chair back. Maybe. Oh, so close. Oh, let's, you know what? Let's tear down this wall. Yes. Okay. All right, we've made it. Do I have a roof on this thing? Yeah. Just do an auto roof. And then we're going to... Where'd the crib go? Oh no, what happened to the crib? Did I sell the crib? Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, hold on. I didn't mean to sell the crib. Uh, okay, let's try this. There! <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Let's do the roof. Drinks really gets you going. Won't it's you so loud. And you feel you're so <laughs> Why is that so loud? Oh my god. <laughs> Hot drinks, y'all. I'm sorry that was so loud. Uh, okay. Wait, did I do something else? What did I do? <laughs> I think that's good. Now, if she gets off the bench, we can move the bench in there. I'm gonna sell- I meant to sell the chair. That's what I meant to sell. No, get off the bench! Uh, thank you so much for the nine months, Wicked Brony one! Thank you! Get up! Just go here for a second! I'm gonna let you go back to sleep! But you're gonna get to go back to sleep inside, so you can cool off! Okay. No, don't lounge. Why do I keep doing that? You're watching DuckTales? <laughs> DuckTales. Ooh, I used to love that show when I was a kid. Right, we're going to have her go inside and nap. And now they can take turns napping inside and hopefully cool off some. Like, okay, now we can change the kid's diaper. And then we're going to put him... He's doing fine, so we'll just put him down on the ground and let him play. And then we'll take care of dad. He needs to go to the bathroom. Let's clean up this diaper. And let's serve. Let's make some baths. 
I did fix the roof. I just didn't show you guys. See? I just had I just had it like the walls down, but I did fix it. You found your love in cappuccino. <laughs> I love cappuccino too. Um I I have listened to Marina and the Diamonds um a long time ago and I can't really remember I can't really remember it how I felt about it. But I didn't like get the album or anything, so I don't know if I liked it that much. <laughs> Thank you so much for the two month resub, Angel Siren. But I would I would listen to it again because sometimes if I don't and it's been years ago, sometimes if I listen to something and I don't care for it, I can listen to it like in a couple of months or years later and I might like it because it's I just wasn't in the right place for it at the time, if that makes sense. Oh, they did a DuckTales reboot? Oh, we got a beg for gift sub from M Sims, nineteen 98 EM Sims. Anybody feels generous? I don't know what the upside down show is. I might have been too old for that. Um, I love you. Do any of you guys watch Clarence? That's my favorite cartoon right now that's made for kids is Clarence. I love that one. Hot drinks. Really good. No, I stopped drinking coffee. Well, I'll drink it every once in a while, but I don't drink it daily anymore. Since I'm trying not to drink much caffeine. <laughs> name the baby Snee in honor of Caleb misspelling his name. Put away single plate leftovers. I had no idea they rebooted DuckTales. That's crazy. Okay, he needs- I'm just gonna have him go ahead and go to sleep. Yeah, the baby's fine. Out here, he's not too hot now. Oh my god, she's not getting any rest there. Let's- Let's get her awake. She's still hot, too. Oh no, she cooled down. She cooled down. Okay, let's have her go to sleep. She's not doing so well. Oh, thank you so much, Trist, for uh, giving M. Sims a gift sub. Thank you so much. <laughs> you guys never heard of Clarence? Oh, you love Clarence. I still watch it. I'll wa I'll watch it over and over. I never get tired of it. Thank you, July Baby Cakes. Have you ever watched Owl House? No, I never heard of it. That's the only, um, is a stream buffering? I hope it's not crapping out. Thank you, Christina. <laughs> okay, let's, he's getting hot now. Um, let's have him get a drink. It's like, you just have to manage the heat stroke constantly in this challenge. It's just, it's summer all the time and they're just like always hot. <laughs> Andrew likes Adventure Time, but I never really got into it. Get yourself a drink, cool yourself off. <laughs> and... Come sit in inside for a little while. Actually, we'll put the baby inside, too. And come sit inside. I don't know what the point is of rebooting DuckTales. Like, I feel like the original DuckTales is really good. <coughs> Alright, put the kid in there. Let's check in on her. She's... Well, at least she's getting her comforts all the way up. At least she, we can get her energy up. You didn't put the kid in bed. And I hope you can put him in there. Oh, you can't put him in there. I need to turn the crib around. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I gotta turn it. Okay. Now put him in there. Okay, very good. And you can come out here now that you're cooled off and get some sleep. Yeah. Go ahead and sleep in there. And then you... 
are starving. Why are you gardening when you're starving? Go get some leftovers. You recommend Black Mass on Netflix? Somebody, I heard somebody else talking about that that was good. Now, I've never seen Gumball before. I'm, like, way out of touch with, with recent cartoons. That'll change once I have my kid, I'm sure. The new She-Ra? No, I didn't see that. <laughs> yeah, gardening while starving. That's taking the long view. <laughs> That's taking the long way. <laughs> Simney Spears is Caleb without an eye. He's still an icon, a legend, and a moment. <laughs> Yes, I want to make my shack big enough for the bed. That's my that's my dream. We have 244 simoleons. But I think once we send um once Arrow wakes up I'm gonna send him over to gather some more. And then maybe we'll have enough to pull it out one more. <laughs> you wanna watch DuckTales on CRT TV while eating pizza? <laughs> Yes, what's wrong? What's wrong? Okay, let's go to the bathroom. Poor thing. She needs fun so bad. Let's have her go get some sleep. Maybe now everybody can get some sleep. Nobody's having a heat stroke for the moment. It's so dark out here at night. But I guess that's how it would have been, right? Gumball, I have to give that a try. Oh, Fruits Basket. Yes, I love Fruits Basket. Did you hear um, that they're making, that they did a prequel to Fruits Basket that tells the story of the mom? I thought of you, Hendrick, when I read that. But I haven't seen it yet. But I'm, I want to. Malcolm and Caitlin have chemistry in Sims 2? Wow. Uh, okay, let's, let's see. Uh, thank you for the 100 bits, Satrina. Yes, I do plan to stream on Saturdays, yeah. And, and thank you for uh, joining me, too. Alright, so let's take the kid, let's go ahead and wake Dad up and let's take the kid to the bathroom. We can get him potty trained, that would be so helpful. Oh, you watched the prequel? It was interesting. Was it good? I want to watch it. What would I do if I won the lottery? Well, it depends on how much I won. Okay, we're going to get the... Oops, no. Sorry. Potty train him. Potty train him. Hurry. Don't drink the rancid bottle, kid. If I won, like, millions of dollars... I would, the first thing I would do is buy a bigger house. <laughs> Number one, I would buy a bigger house. And then I would buy a house for my stepdad. And then I would buy a house for my sister. I would buy everybody in my family who needs a house, I would buy them a house. <laughs> That's what I'd do. Thank you, Miss Cora Sims. Goodbye. <laughs> Wait, did I see somebody say something about the... You watched the prequel and you ugly, ugly cried a lot? Oh, that means I need to watch it. Good for you, Lance. Now let's get him a bottle. And get bottle for Lance. And then I'm going to have you go across the street and get us some more money and see if we can enlarge the shack here. Thank you so much for the 11 months, Asa Bazaar. Oh, thank you. Uh, okay, let's walk across the street. To the... No, just by yourself to the bathing lot. And we're going to gather up some lovely coconuts. And some papayas that we can sell. See how much bigger we can make the shack. Vidkin and Cassandra Goth in a mega hood. I don't know. I think they'd make a good couple. I think that'd be a good idea. Do they have chemistry? <laughs> uh, a Sims-themed nursery. 
I don't know if we're really gonna have a theme. Because... It's probably just going to be a bunch of mismatched stuff that we get as gifts and stuff. <laughs> I don't think we're going to have a, a theme per se. I don't know yet, though. I'll let you know how it goes. I don't even know which room I'm going to put the nursery in. I was almost thinking of making our big bedroom into our bedroom and the nursery and then making the little bedroom into my workroom. Because my lights and my equipment and stuff, they take up so much room. So I, we still haven't really 100% figured out how we're going to do this. All right, gather some coconuts. Um, I am in the second trimester and the Sim is in the second trimester. <laughs> we both are. They have three bolts. Ooh. I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. Diddly dee. <laughs> I can't help it. I have to sing it every time. Uh, what did he just gather? Coconuts. Okay. Uh, go get some papaya. And that's coconut. <coughs> yeah, the theme will be a kid having fun with the Sims 3 color wheel. Yeah. <laughs> We've already bought all of our baby clothes that I think... I think we bought all the baby... Like, I don't want to buy too many baby clothes because you never... Because this is something I didn't know before I had before I got pregnant. Is there's two different sizes of baby clothes that your baby might fit into when they're born. There's newborn size and there's a zero to three month size. So you just kind of have to buy both of them. And so I don't want to buy too many. I have to wait and see how big she's going to be first. But so we bought like 10 of each, like 10 onesies of each. So I hope that's going to be enough at... at first coconut spears <laughs> all right i'm sending you back home now actually while you're here why don't you just go ahead and take a shower just take a full shower while you're here arrow and what does he want to do cleaning skill and i'm gonna i'm gonna lock in gain a skill point for him because he can definitely do that a mobile made of sim plum bobs i would love that i would love that <laughs> Oh, Jetset, welcome, and thank you for the 21 months. Cassandra and Pascal were a really good match in your base game. Oh, I can see that. I can see that. <laughs> yeah, my nursery's gonna be, like, just random stuff, probably. I don't think I'm gonna have a real theme for it. Uh, midwives do have to have training in the U.S., but they don't have to train as a doctor. But they do have to be trained. My midwife has been delivering babies for 12 years. And she's a registered, a registered midwife, so she's been through all the training and everything. And then her assistant is a registered nurse. So at my birth, I will have my registered midwife and a registered nurse there. Anybody can call themselves a midwife, but to be a registered midwife, you have to go through training. Uh, thank you so much for the 12 months, I suspect, Nargles. Thank you. You want to try this challenge, but all the CC mods and rules feel a little daunting. I get that, but it's not that bad. It's really not. I just create a new Sims 2 folder for it. Download Most of the downloads are in bulk, so it's not like you have to go through and download everything individually. It wasn't, it wasn't that hard for me. It's one of the easier ones. Okay, let's send him back home. And we can sell what he got. <laughs> I've had Darren and Nina together. Darren and Nina got together in my Sims 3. I don't think I've ever had them together in Sims 2. Do I think she'll look like me or Andrew more? I don't know. I hope she looks like Andrew. <laughs> I hope she has my eyes, though. I think she'll have curly hair. Because Andrew has curly hair. And curly hair is in my family a lot. So I would not be surprised if she had curly hair. And I think she'll have green eyes because Andrew and I both have green eyes. But there's a small chance she'll have blue eyes. She'll definitely be brunette because we're both brunette. Um, I'm due December 11th. 
All right, let's see here. Check in on her. Okay, she, I'm just going to let her sleep as long as we can. The baby's doing fine. He's over there just playing with his little, little blocks. <laughs> you don't have to be an RN in the U.S. to be a midwife, but you do have to go through, like, similar training. But some midwives are also RNs, but mine's not. There's only one midwife in my area. In my town, there's only one. Who does home births. <coughs> but I love her. I love her. She's wonderful. Oh, you were born a month early? I have not looked for a pediatrician yet. Um, I'm going to ask my midwife who she will recommend. Because I want somebody who is uh, open to my choices. <laughs> I want somebody who's not going to, like, try to shame me for having a home birth and stuff because some people are just not cool with that. I don't understand why. You were born four months early? Wow. <laughs> yeah, I was not born early, but I did have jaundice when I was born. But I was born on time. Oh, my kidney stones move at all. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I had to be I had to be placed under one of those like ink I had to be placed in an incubator when I was a baby. Yes, I am pregnant. I am Gregnant. <laughs> I'm gonna speed this up, y'all, because nothing's happening here. Yeah, I'm having a home birth. Well, I'm planning a home birth. Is you know, uh, if I went into labor before 37 weeks, I can't. That like, you can't do a home birth. You have to go to the hospital. Um, and if I go longer than 42 weeks, I can't have a home birth. And of course, if there are any complications, like if I were to get gestational diabetes or something like that, because my midwife she can only do uncomplicated births that are due on time for home births because you know they just they don't want to take the risk and I get that so right now everything's going smoothly but if anything came up I might have to go to the hospital so I'm just keeping myself open like I want to do a home birth but if I can't I can't but that's what we're planning for okay she's awake let's have her go take a sponge bath and let's sell all this stuff yeah, I need to get I need to get some apple cider vinegar in my water. Yeah. Sweet potatoes, I think we can sell those. And I know we can sell these peas and cauliflower. So now we have 509, y'all. I wonder how how much that'll get us. Home births are not allowed in your country. Oh no, that sucks. Bad. Uh, thank you so much, Lord Crumbs. Hello! Thank you for the 20 months and welcome. And thank you for the 13 months, Mr. Roboto. <laughs> um, yes, it is cheaper to do a home birth, yes. Uh, for me. Maybe not, it depends on the insurance you have, I guess, but for us, yeah, it's cheaper. Um, let me see. How big... And we make this. If we could pull it out one more, that's out of bounds. Dang it. If we could make it this big, oh, I don't think we're going to be able to. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do here. Let's move this. I should read made for this. Oh, okay. I'll add that to my list. I have to read uh, Ina May's Guide to Childbirth. That's what my midwife gave me to read. And then Andrew's going to read the book called The Birth Partner. Because he's going to be helping me push this baby out. <laughs> oh, we have to pay big time. I should actually go to the doctor now for my kidney stone, but it's so expensive. I'm trying to just pass it on my own. 
That's what you have to do in the United States. You're like, how bad is the situation? Do I need to go to the hospital? You wait till you're like almost dead before you can go. Yeah, I got birth homework, yeah. I'm wondering if we can pull this out. Oh, so close, but you know what? If we delete these... Ooh. You don't pr feel pregnant yet at 15 weeks? I started to feel her move about... Drinks really get you going. Won't you up when you feel you're slowing? That is so loud. I'm so sorry, guys. Hold on, I'll tell you, I'll finish my thought. <laughs> oh god. Sorry. Excuse me. Um, I start to feel her about 17 weeks probably. I have an anterior placenta, so my placenta is in the front. And that makes it take longer for you to be able to feel. But I can feel her almost every day now. Um, but I started feeling like flutters and stuff around like 16, 17 weeks. But if it depends on where your placenta is. I'm gonna bulldoze these. See if that's enough. Come on. Can I fit the bed in that? I don't know. I got jump scared by my own singing. <laughs> it's too small. Um, I will be vaccinating my kids with I'll every informed how girl get pregnant. With every possible vaccine they can get, yes, I will do that. <laughs> Ow. I don't know how girl got pregnant. I have no idea. Well, you know what? At least somebody can, they can take turns. They can take turns sleeping in there. <laughs> let's, fi let's fix the roof. They're gonna have to sleep in shifts now. I don't even think I have enough to paper. Yeah, I have enough. <laughs> Somebody can sleep out here. <laughs> there. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze again. Okay, I guess not. <laughs> ah. Oh, that wasn't it. That wasn't an invasive question. I don't care. I'll tell everybody who wants to know <laughs> that I will, yes, I will be vaccinating my children. My child. Thank you for the 200 bits, Lord Crumbs. Oh, uh, thank you for giving out five gift subs, Lord Crumbs. To Floofin Boy, Juxu, Juji's Low, Sky Sky 1135, and Blunt. <laughs> Okay, let's see if we can... Well, nobody's tired now, so... Oh, well. She's going to take a sponge bath. And... The kid's okay. I think we can put him down for a nap. He's gonna... He wants to toss him in the air. That's so sweet. <laughs> it, it had to have been really hard back then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> my mic is glitchy is that better sometimes if the cord gets loose it starts to like crackle so tell me if you hear that i think i just i pushed it back in uh thank you so much for the 100 bits jersey girl 1981 is it harder getting pregnant with pcos yeah um i never thought i could get pregnant at all that's why i'm have my first kid at 39. Um, oh, she stinks. I thought I told you to go take a sponge bath. <laughs> I'm tw I'll be 20 weeks tomorrow. 
So five months. You thought your headphones were broke? Oh, I'm sorry. Does it sound better now? Was it crackling? I know because I recorded a video last week or like a couple days ago. And when I listened to it back, the mic was crackling. And I realized that. So I have to redo the whole video. Um, and I realized it's because the cord was loose. Okay, it sounds good now. Okay, just tell me if you hear it again. Okay, so she's taking a sponge bath. And you know what? We need to send. We're going to send him out. Do they have spears? Do they have hunting spears? No. Okay, well, we can't spend any money on hunting spears. So we're just going to have him go fish. I'm also going to check in on the garden. Oh, we can harvest these now. Actually, go harvest these. Harvest um, a basket of blueberries. And then we'll see if you can fish after that. It's still crackling? Maybe I need a new cord. Let's see. Maybe I can like prop this up somehow. How's that? Is it normal? Don't know because I can't hear it. It sounds normal. Sparks came out. You don't, you only hear it when I talk. Yeah, that's what it was doing. Is it okay? It's normal now. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I think I'll try to get a new cord and see if that helps. Because it's bothering me too whenever I try to record a video and it's all crackly. <laughs> okay, good. Hello, Angel Angel Fowl. Oh, she's getting too hot again. Come inside and relax on the bed and cool off. That's what you need to do. Where the heck's the kid? Oh, he's right there. He was supposed to be put down. Okay, we're going to take him over to the potty. Crap, we have to empty this stupid thing every time. <laughs> Hello, Tip the Witch. Oh, I got a save game too. Let me save. Yeah, I know I haven't streamed in seven months. This is my first stream in seven months. <coughs> All right, let's go potty train the baby. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Lord Crumbs, for gifting a sub to T Addict. Uh oh, we got baby bump number two. So we're going to have the baby Tuesday at 10 a.m., y'all. She's going to have her baby. <laughs> My dog's out there barking at me. Sorry, pup. You can't come in. Um, I'm going to have her keep relaxing here because she's still really hot. I know. I can't. That time went by so fast for me. <laughs> but, like, a lot of it, I was just... For four months, I was just sick every day, and I couldn't do anything but just, like, lay there and eat toast. <laughs> it was really bad. I couldn't have streamed if I wanted to during that. Other Sims can spill water on them to help them? How do they do that? How do you do that? Did he go to the potty? I guess he did not. Will he not go? Or did he go? They can only spill if they have a heat stroke. Oh, so if they pass out from heat stroke, you can, like, click on them and do that? Yes, I do have a baby bump. I showed it earlier. <laughs> okay, I'll try that the next time somebody uh, passes out. I had no idea you could do that. A strong hot coffee. That actually sounds good to me, but I, I'm trying not to drink coffee. You missed it? I'll show you again in a minute. <laughs> I'll reveal it again. Why Why will he not take him to the potty? It's cause, is he too tired? He's too tired. Okay, well, let's just put him down. Oh, he fell. No, wake up, baby. 
I'm trying to put you in the crib. Yes, this will be uploaded to YouTube in 24 hours. <laughs> oh, I can't have the crib like that? He's not going to be able to put him in it? Ah, crap. Okay. What are we going to do? Maybe we can turn... You know what we can do? Go out, go out here for a second. Go out here! Everybody get out! Everybody get out of the shack! It's douse. Okay, I'm trying to... This is not... Let's turn move objects on. And I can just move everybody where I want them to be. There. How about that? That should work. Now it's clear. Now somebody put this kid in the bed. <clears throat> and I'm going to have her go back inside. Let's see how she's doing. She needs to go to the bathroom and get something to eat. I'm just going to have her basically relax in the shack the whole time that she doesn't need to eat or go to the bathroom. And then he'll put the kid down and then he can get some lunch. No, put Lance in crib. Lance, wake up. Wake up, child. <laughs> Yeah, I'm very skeptical about the new wants and fears, Jersey Girl. I'm very skeptical. I'm very... I'm worried. Thank you, uh... Thank you, Marsh Viper. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining me. Have a great day. You secretly hoping I was having twins? I would I would have been okay with having twins. I, would, I couldn't do home birth if I had twins. But it would be nice if I could just have my two kids all at once. And then I wouldn't have to worry about going through it again. <laughs> you already pre-bought the pack? Well, it's coming to... The wants and fears are coming to base game, too. So you don't even have to buy the pack if you just want that. I want to have two kids, but I don't know if I'll be able to. I'm just thankful for the one. I'm trying not to get greedy. <laughs> but if I could have two, I would. Because I would just like for my, you know, I, I was so close to my siblings. I would like for my child to have a sibling. But if it's not possible, it's not possible. Um, oh, he, now he's in here on the bed. All right. Let's get him out. He needs to go eat anyway. I'm sorry, pups. I can't do, I can't help you. My dog's out there barking. Daddy will be home in a few minutes. He can take care of you. Okay. Thank you, Tiana. I am doing great. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's so nice of you to say. Uh, you're working on completely making an integrated neighborhood. That's awesome. It's so fun to do. It really is. Have I thought about adoption? I've thought about it. Yeah. And it's not out of the question either for us. If we're only able to have one, it's not out of the question. Um, okay, let's have her go relax inside before she has another freaking heat stroke on me. Oh, the dogs and my cat are doing great. Doing fine. Only the dogs want, I think they want to go outside. But Andrew will be back any minute and he can let them out. <laughs> I do have, we do have a name picked for our, for our baby. But I'm not going to tell you until she's born. <laughs> the secret. <laughs> you can never go back now, I know. <gasps> Alright, let's see. What are we going to do with Arrow here? Um. Well, I guess he can fish. He can fish for us and try to catch us some fish. Oh, hello there, cold drinks. Name her after Katrina Caliente. Now, you know I'm not going to do that. Melba Katrina. That's what I'm going to name her. <laughs> Hi, Josh. Oh, everything's going great. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the congratulations. Claire Ursine. 
<laughs> wow, he caught a big one. Look at that. I want to see what it was. A jumbo blue catfish. All right. <laughs> we should dress as the goth family for Halloween. <laughs> Name the baby girl Mortimer. I don't think so. <laughs> Little baby Mortimer. <laughs> I know. That's so funny. That's so funny, mitochondrial DNA. When Baby Pleasant goes to school, she'll be telling everyone about how Nervous Subject was tortured as a child and how Cassandra's heart was broken. She'll, I'm going to tell her all the sim stories, like fairy tales, like bedtime stories. I'd be like, once upon a time, there was a girl named Cassandra God. <laughs> she lived in a town called Pleasant View. I'm going to tell her all the stories. <laughs> I hear you. Yeah, this is the first time I've played The Sims 2 in like six months. Yeah. I can tell her all the different outcomes. I wonder which story will be, her, which Sims lore story will be her favorite. <laughs> Don't tell her about Dawn. I know. Gotta protect her. <laughs> Lance only has two days left before his birthday. Oh no, he's crying. Let's see. Well, he stinks and he needs a bottle. What is she doing out here? Oh well, I guess if that's where you want to lay, fine. Let's go get him another bottle. Uh, I get bottle for Lance. Yeah, I rolled the pacifier. Yeah, I did. Brandy will be her favorite. <laughs> oh, he woke her up with his crying. Yeah, that's right. She was like, screw that. I'm going out. She didn't even check to see what he needed. She's like, I'm going outside to sleep, kid. Oh, thanks, Zachopotamus. Yeah, I did roll the pacifier. Yeah. Okay, get him. Get your stinky baby boy a bottle. He stinks. <laughs> Dawn can be a cautionary tale, yes. <laughs> name the baby Lord Crumps. What a beautiful name. <laughs> this is my daughter, Lord Crumps. Um, okay, I'm gonna send her back inside to go to sleep. I'm sorry, dogs. I'm busy. I'm busy. Um, okay, he's dying, gonna freaking die of a heat stroke now. He's in the bathroom. Oh, you know what? We can change the kid's diaper now. I think, yeah. <laughs> Nut. I'm not gonna name my, I'm not gonna, Nutella! <laughs> Nutella, I love it! With a K! That's it, that's her name. No, I'm not going to name my daughter after a Sims meme, y'all. <laughs> Alright, snuggle your snuggle your boy. And then he's fine. You can put him down to play. And then you also need to sleep. But you know what? You'll have to sleep on the bench. Or you'll, you know what? Why don't you sleep in here? Wendy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wendy sounds too much like Cindy, though. Um, I don't have the Sims 2 RPC mod. I was just talking about that earlier. I need to get it. I don't know why I don't. Just laziness, I guess. <laughs> She's gonna have the same middle name as me. My, my baby's gonna have the same middle name as me. My mom, my sister, me, and... My grandma, my mom, my sister, and me all have the same middle name. And I'm going to pass it on to my daughter, too. <laughs> I'll name her Sleeve McDykel. <laughs> uh, okay, why, why are you not sleeping? Is he waking you up every time? Alright, clean up the poopy diapers and stuff then. That's fine. 
<laughs> Shown for caught. <laughs> I love those stupid names. Your dad and you share the same middle name too? Bobson Dugnut. That's my favorite one of all. What is wrong with her? She's having a heat stroke. She's inside. How can she have a heat stroke inside? Oh, did I stop her from having a heat stroke? Or is it too late? Is it too late? Willie Dustus. Are you going to pass out or not? Look at her needs, y'all. Look at her needs. Okay. She's going to sleep now. Hank Burb, yeah. No, you won't die of heat stroke, but you can, like, die of hunger and stuff while you're having a heat stroke. What? Sleep in there. Thank you so much for the 13 months orb of wisdom. Thank you. Anna, totally s'morin. Her needs did tank. Okay, we're getting her energy up now. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I like simple names. And I like unique names. <laughs> but I like uh, classic names. But the name we chose is not a classic name. The name we chose is not a common name, but it's also not like super weird. <laughs> wow. The only reason you have a middle name at all is because your parents saw a baby, Ashley. <laughs> yeah, I don't do any I don't do any weird spellings. Where Y's or I's and stuff like that. I like everything to be classic and simple. Make it as easy on my child as possible. Wow, middle name was required by law in Germany? That's interesting. We're not required to have middle names here. It's just like tradition. Um, yeah, I'll probably do only knowledge sims can plead, Dina. Yeah, for life. Yeah. Where are you? What are you doing over here? You're supposed to be asleep, buddy. Can you not sleep with a kid playing right there? Oh no, she's having nightmares, y'all. Raven's having nightmares. Her needs are so bad. I'm gonna let her sleep for a little bit longer and then I'm gonna try to take care of her bladder. She really needs to have some fun, but I mean, like, life is not fun in prehistoric times. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Your mom named you from a movie? I was named after my midwife. My mom's midwife. Her name was Cindy. <laughs> and I guess she and my mom were really close. <laughs> wow, your mom changed her mind when she was in labor about your name. That's pretty cool. <laughs> My sister's name is Marianne. I have a sister named Marianne. Okay, the oh my god, the baby's gonna have a heat stroke. What the heck? Alright, you need to go to the bathroom. She's having a heat stroke. I guess it's too warm under all those animal furs. If she pa- oh my god, y'all! Oh, this is real bad. This is really bad. Please get... She just peed her pants. She just peed her pants. Okay, go take a sponge bath. Yes, please. This is bad. Oh, my God. Oh, toddlers won't get it? Okay. Then we'll just let him stay outside. She needs to eat. We need to get these long, needs up. Long. Fix the roof. Yeah. Yeah, I did fix the roof. 
Love me some long, long man. Now, let's check. Okay, the kid needs to be potty trained. Oh, he wants to be potty trained, too. I'm going to lock that in. Let's see if we can get Dad to take him to the potty. <laughs> I missed that song, too. Your cat danced to it? That's funny. <laughs> if your cat dances to Long Long Man, that's a cool cat. <laughs> Some people give their kids two... My, my niece has two middle names. She has... Three I gotta figure out how to adjust the sound on that. That is loud. Did I say thank you for the tier one sub, Mal Mally's Acre? Thank you. If I didn't. Um, do Sims normally have nightmares or is that a mod? They do. That's not a mod. They will have nightmares if their needs are really low and they're not doing well. Yeah. Okay, she needs fun. What the heck can we do for fun? You know what? We can play Red Hands. That's what we're going to do. Oh, wow. You got like three middle names. Four middle names? Or your friend does? Crazy. Sims 2 has consequences. That's what I'm saying. Uh, thank you so much for the 100 bits, Angel Siren. Thank you so much. Play Red Hands. See, she's doing better now. Her uh, mood meter's up. Uh-oh. Baby's tired. Baby's tired. You're gonna have to take a break from your game. Put Lance in the crib. It will not be a standard Southern double namer. Nope. I'm not doing the double name. <laughs> My sister is a double name, I guess you could say. <clears throat> yes, the miscarriage mod is installed. Which I can't believe she Raven here has made it through this pregnancy. I'm gonna have her go uh, play some more Red Hands. Just try to keep all of her other needs up as much as I can. Is the mic okay? I worry when I move it that it's... Barbara Ann. Bar 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 Barbara Ann. I don't think I'll do Barbara Ann. <laughs> you have a country name? Is that it? Is that it, Kim? Ah! Really gets you going. Won't you up when you feel you slow Man, this has gotta be miserable living in this. Summertime all the time. <laughs> yeah, red hands really gotta hurt when you're that sunburned. Ouch. Ouch. She might not make it through the childbirth, but I don't know. We have her doing a lot better now. We have her doing a lot better, and she's due in just a couple hours. I don't know. I don't think she'll die. I have hope. I have hope, y'all. <laughs> Aw, uh, thank you so much for the Prime Sub Left Wing Lesbians. Thank you. Red hands, but your hands are actually red. Aw, <laughs> uh, thanks for gifting a sub to Simdi. <laughs> thank you, Lord Crumps. Hot drinks is a new scream, scream sound, I know. Okay, you're just gonna sleep. That's fine. You can sleep out here. I haven't really been paying attention to his needs very much. Because I've been worried about her. But she's doing alright now. Aw, thank you for the 100 bits, Lord Crunks. I, it's, it's needs that, in, that increase the odds of death. It's the needs. It's mostly energy and hunger, I think. Ow. Oh, yeah, well, if this baby's a girl, we're gonna name her Brittany. But if it's a boy, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. What should we name it if it's a boy? Now, this is the Spears family. We got Arrow, Raven, and Lance Spears. Aw, oh, thank you for the 300 bits, Lord Crumps. <laughs> okay, what are you doing? What are you- you're always gardening, man. They love to garden. 
go use that the turlet get a bottle for lance and then eat something slay <laughs> justin timberlake spears <laughs> Aw, thank you for giving out the five gift subs, Lord Crumbs. Thank you for giving gift subs to Kylie97, Nina Unknown, Nizuku K96, JDTV, and Acidic. Thank you. Coke. Pepsi. <laughs> thank you, Angel Siren. Thanks for joining me. Pepsi Spears? Oh, I thought I, I, I didn't press play. Hunter. Do we have a hunter yet? We're gonna name him Hunter. If it's a boy. If it's a boy, we'll name him Hunter. <laughs> Hello, Clementines. We're gonna do Hunter if it's a boy. We'll do Brittany if it's a girl, even though it doesn't match just because we want to do it. We want to do it. We want to name her Britney Spears. <laughs> name it Pepsi? I don't get the joke. What's Pepsi Spears? Pickle Spears? The skunk, the skunk's here. All right, let's check on mom because she's due in just a few hours and we got to make sure her needs are up. Are you just carrying the baby? Is the baby just stuck to the front of you? She likes Pepsi? Oh, Brittany loves Pepsi. Oh, see, I have no idea. I know nothing about Brittany Spears hardly. <laughs> Watch them have only boys, yeah. She's doing all right for once. Oh, she wants to bird watch. You know what? You can spend a little time bird watching. Look, she her her um her heat meter is in the green, y'all. Pointy spears. <laughs> oh, I had I didn't know. I didn't know, Caleb. I didn't know about the Pepsi spears. Pepsi thing. Pepsi spears. Pepsi thing. I think we're gonna go with Hunter, guys. I like Hunter for boy. Uh, thank you so much for the 150 bits, Lord Crumbs. Oh gosh, Dad's about to have a heat stroke. You know what, he's tired too. Let's let him go in the shack and sleep until the baby comes. And then the kid's all right for the moment. She wants to hunt for bugs. I'm gonna let her bird watch a little bit first though. The third summer is the hardest in the game. Really? Are we, oh yeah, we are in the third summer. We got one day left. Ooh, Fisher's good too. I like that. We'll say they're gonna have plenty of kids, so we can use a lot of these names up. <laughs> you have a really creepy ad. What was it? Oh, she used to be a spokesperson for Pepsi. Really? I don't remember that. Oh, if they drink water three times, that gives it goes it to green. I didn't know that. That goes it to green. What kind of grammar was that, Cindy? <laughs> that makes it go green. Um, there's it's it's all summer right now. We're in prehistoric days. It's all summer all the time. They don't get they don't get spring or autumn. <laughs> makes it more challenging. Oh, I gotta hydrate. The baby's coming at 10, so it's like just a few minutes away. And her needs are really good, so I'm quite happy about that. Somehow we got her, she was doing so bad yesterday. It's not the Ice Age. You could, you know what, you could add an Ice Age into the Test of Time challenge. That would be really challenging. No, I'm not bringing the Discord back. It's too stressful for me. In the Roman period, can men join the army? Um, I don't know. I have to think about how that would work. <laughs> Hi, small beach. Okay, come on. Let's speed this up. Let's speed this up. Hope for a girl, y'all. Or for those of you who guessed a boy, hope for a boy. <laughs> Yeah, that's true, Hendrick. You wouldn't be able to live through the 
The reason why it's all summer is because you only have, like, your garden and fishing for food. Oh, no! Do you see that? Do you see that? The male person wandered onto the lot, but I have them all blocked. I know. Very modern PJs on her. She's in prehistoric times. I thought I replaced the PJs, but I guess I didn't. Um, I do... I do hope to finish that. Brit, stop. I do hope to finish my guide on creating custom hoods on my website. My more in-depth guide that I'm doing. <laughs> I have a I have a full guide done, but it's kind of older. It, do it doesn't go into as much de as depth. Blah, blah, blah. Wait, isn't she supposed to be having the baby? Let's... Or no, oh, she's supposed to have it at noon. Did I go back an hour? I was off an hour. She's supposed to have it at noon. I'm sorry. I mismathed. Math hard. She's supposed to have it at noon. She's. I went back an hour instead of forward an hour is what I did. Yep. So it'll be one more hour. We gotta keep her happy for one more hour. Let's have her do a sponge bath. Oh, hello. Nene Phillips. Nene Philippine. Okay. Thank you so much for the 250 bits, Josh. If she has a boy and a girl, then if she has twins, then we go with the firstborn on the predictions. Yeah. Come on, come on. I'm ready for this babby, y'all. We need a babby. The first babby of my return. Oh, she's going to the bathroom real quick. <laughs> Math hard, English hard. <laughs> yeah, she just casually checked out. She was naked when Nene came up. Alright, here we go. Oh, come on, Dad. Get over here. Get over here. <laughs> she was having a turlet baby. <laughs> Here it comes, here it comes. Oh, it's just one. It's just, it's just one. Come on, Will it be a boy or a girl? Yes. Yes. Uh, I didn't see it, Lord Crumps, but that's awesome. I will have to look into that. Because I'll need the Roman stuff. It's a boy! <laughs> it's Hunter, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm sorry we didn't get Brittany. They'll have a girl eventually. <laughs> it's Hunter. Okay, so we got Hunter and Lance so far. Sorry, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna do the prediction. Prediction. Um, Choose outcome. It was a boy. All right, there's your points, y'all. It's Hunter. I love this game, too. It's so fun. All right, so now we've got two babies and one crib. Now we have ourselves a dilemma. What are we going to do? They're just going to have to take turns in the crib, I guess. You know what? Can we afford a dog bed? Can we afford a dog bed? That is a good question. No. No. We almost can. You know what? If somebody goes to gather, if we send the dad over to gather, we can get a dog bed for the toddler. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. Okay, let's send him over there. Well, go see your new child first. Go see your new son. Oh no, this kid needs to go to the turlet. Oh no, he already crapped himself. Alright, you... Can we not change his diaper yet? Can you just go? You change diaper. You are going to cuddle your new child. <laughs> it's not Brittany, bitch. <laughs> oh, did I say thank you for the three? Thank you for the three months sometimes, Gab. All right, now you put your baby down on the, gra on the ground. 
Do that first. <laughs> Somebody's gassy. Somebody's always gassy in my streams. Um, and let's walk across and let's get enough money for a toddler bed and then we have all of our bases covered. Then the next thing we need to save up for is to make the shack big enough to where both of our sims can sleep in the bed. That would be great. That'd be a great start. Uh, thank you so much for the seven months in Armadillo Pinata. Thank you. <laughs> um, I do have the baby mat thing. The Dangle Master, I think that's what it's called. But I gotta see if it's been recolored or not. I might have a recolor for it. What are you gonna do? Take a shower? Oh, he's going straight to take a shower. All right, cool. Yeah, because you, you dirty and stinky. You stink. The next decade is uh, Roman. The next phase is Roman. After our first child gets to an adult. Which I think is going to be that last family. The stones, I think, will probably be the first one. Uh, no, I'm not on Discord anymore. But I'll look it up or you can email it to me. Come on, take your shower, buddy. And then we're going to go gather up some lovely coconuts. And we're going to gather up some papayas. And we're going to sell those bad boys. I'm very happy to be here. Thank you, Crimson. Am I naming a baby during the Roman era Jesus? No. No, I will not be doing that. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to sneeze again. I'm looking into the light. Oh, I hate that. I don't know why that keeps happening. Oh, okay. It's not officially uploaded yet. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, then you can send it. He will, he will climb those trees now. Can you imagine the slide down? He slid down that tree, the tree with no clothes on. <laughs> he did. All right, let's go back home. I can't. That sounds terrible. Just climbing a tree in the new... It's not the climbing so much. It's the sliding back down that gets me. You're going to get tree burnt. You're going to get... You're going to burn your coconuts. <laughs> Sandpaper jubblies. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for these six months, Big Kratos. Oh, no. Why didn't that show up on the screen? Is it delayed? <clears throat> do 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 so this is going to work out perfectly. Like, right about the time it's time to end the stream, we're going to be done with this family. So it's going to work out great. Um, okay, so let's check in on her and see how she's doing after the birth. Raven, how are you doing? Okay, you need you need some things. Your baby... Let's You know what? Let's put the baby uh, in the crib. Let's put Lance in the crib for now. The other baby should be fine for a little while. Have I seen the updated Gussie Up mod where you can pick and choose what outfit instead of them all? Uh, no, I haven't. I didn't know it was updated, but that's good news. Check that out. There goes Big Kratos. <laughs> there are new mods for The Sims 2. Some of them are on Reddit. <clears throat> yeah, I got. I haven't looked at mods or custom content or anything in like six months, so I gotta check. I gotta check that out when I get time. See what's new in the neighborhood. All right, she's going to go nurse baby. <laughs> uh, what hidden traits do I think one of my families in this challenge have? I don't think they, any of them do yet that I know of. Okay, she's nursing. And then... <gasps> I know, pups, I'm sorry. I don't know where Andrew is. He's supposed to be home by now. I'm almost done, though. Both of my dogs are just sitting out the side of the door staring at me. I can see them because my door is made of glass. A lifetime want chooser? Oh, yeah, that'd be very helpful. Ow. Ow. Driving, driver's license mod? Oh, I gotta check that out, too. That sounds cool. 
Yeah, I do. I have some catching up to do for sure. All right, for you, you need to put the baby down. And let's go to the bathroom. Get some, oh, there's no food. We'll serve some bass with squash. <laughs> New custom lifetime once? Oh, that's something I've always dreamed of for The Sims 2. Who's working on that? It's the same one, Lord Crumbs. It's pleasantsims at gmail.com. Should be the same. It's the one I've always had. Lemaire is working on it. That is awesome. I always thought it wasn't possible to do custom lifetime ones because nobody's ever figured out how to do it that I know of. So that's awesome. I'm really looking forward to that. Is he gardening again? I know he is. Yeah, that's really exciting. I gotta go. I'm, I'm way behind. Oh, God, not again. You're falling asleep in your bass. And now the baby's crying. <laughs> Life is hard, y'all. Life is hard for these... These prehistoric sims. I am alive. I'm alive! You have custom memories, but you have to manually input them? Oh, custom memories is another thing I've always wanted. You think we'll have custom aspirations? That'd be great. Yeah, I gotta go check out all the new mods. I do. Maybe I'll have to make a new video about new Sims 2 mods. Okay, no, don't eat anymore. Go, um, change diaper. Lance will grow up in one day. That'll be on our next round, though. Yeah, I think it'd be cool to have a creativity aspiration, too. Aw, thank you. I missed you, too. Alright, give him a cuddle, put him down, and you need to go get some sleep. And you... We haven't even been working with him on teaching him how to walk, I just realized. Teach him to walk. This kid doesn't know how to walk. <laughs> I was trying to make a video, like, I'm definitely going to make more videos for YouTube. And I was trying to make one last week because I wanted- I only did one video last week. I'm gonna be happy if I can do one video a week, but I'd like to try to do more. And I was like, I don't know what to make anymore. I don't know what kind of video to make anymore. What should I do? <laughs> so I gotta think about it. I gotta get back in my groove. Was that Nut? I missed him. I missed him if it was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Spotty B. Well, I'm back now with the Test of Time Challenge. Pleasant View Next Gen. Yeah, I know. You guys have been asking for that. I'll, I'll definitely do another video on that. How you install RPC? That'd be a good one. Because I need to install it myself. Yeah, I'd like the power aspiration to be in game too. Maybe somebody can figure out how to do that. I know it's time, Nathan. It's way past time, isn't it? It's way past time for me to get that mod. Um, all right, let's see. Let's take him and see if we can potty. I can't believe that he's not potty trained yet. Oh my god, we gotta put these leftovers away before they go to waste. We can't be wasting that bass. Oh, I forgot to sell. I gotta sell his stuff, y'all. And we gotta buy the bed. We can sell these tomatoes. Um, I'm not gonna sell the catfish right now, I don't think. I guess I will sell the catfish. They're just living on bass and porridge at this point. But we need the money, so I'm gonna sell the catfish. And then, we could probably buy another crib for that. <laughs> I know, Sims in all games getting houses and apartments for cheaper than in real life. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, what am I doing? Crib? A crib is... Oh, a crib is only 50? A crib is only 50 simoleons? Yeah, we will get another crib. We will get a second crib. And then we might even be able to pull out the shack one more. 
um, and put the second crib inside as well. That was a good haul we got. Okay, so let's put the second crib in as well. And then let's wallpaper this with animal skins. Now that's better. Now we just need to be able to pull it out one more, which I don't think we can't. Well, we can't do it that way anyway. How much is that? Eight? We'd only get eight simoleons for that stupid thing, so I'm just going to keep it for now. The kids can sleep in it when they get older. Nope. Nope, that's not going to work. We got to save up some more money, but maybe next time we play them, we should be able to do it. Can we do... No. We're going to need another one. Aw, thank you, Lord Crumps. <laughs> oh, do you think if I demolish the wall first, I'd have enough? I don't know. I don't know if I would. Okay, put the... Put the kid in there. Did you take him to the potty like I told you to? You didn't. You didn't. Weddings are really cheap, too. My wedding was really cheap. My wedding cost $150. That's how much Andrew and I paid to get married. Seriously. We paid $150. We got married at a wedding chapel, and they did all, like, the decorations and everything. And we had... We did... We only had 12 guests come. And we just did, like, immediate friends and family. I know, baby. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yes, yeah, Sims would... One weddings would cost up to a thousand. I know because I just made a video about that, but I'm going to have to redo it. I'm going to have to redo it. Because my mic was crackly. Yeah, I didn't want a big wedding at all. We just wanted a really small, intimate wedding. And then the, the uh, reception was paid for by our family, so we didn't even have to pay for that. Put Lance in the crib. We're going to let her keep resting. Or she's actually, she's going to have to get up to nurse him, so we'll let them switch out. We'll let you come nurse the baby. Okay, why can't you go here? <laughs> Your aunt and uncle announced their wedding day that they got married. Thank you, Kello Stone. I'm back. Sims 2 is my favorite for weddings. But I, to be fair, I haven't tried out the Sims 4 weddings with the new pack, but I heard I hear it's I hear it's kind of rough. Yep. <laughs> Sims 3 has good weddings too. Yeah. I'm going to have a backyard wedding. That's nice. When Andrew and I got married, we uh lived in a duplex and we didn't have a yard. So we went to the wedding chapel. And it was really nice. It was a lovely wedding. <laughs> it was the best. Getting married was the best day of my life. Getting married to Andrew. The only thing that I think will eclipse it is the day that my daughter's born. <laughs> they kind of fixed it, but it's an absolute chore to manage a wedding. See, that sucks. I gotta try it out, though. Okay, Cuddle Hunter, and let's put him in the crib. <clears throat> Sims 4 is micromanaging, but not in a good way. Like, I love to micromanage, and I love, like, the, the way I can micromanage in The Sims 2, but The Sims 4 is like, you have to micromanage, but it's not fun. Aw, <laughs> uh, thank you so much, Geospizze. Thank you for the 12 months and thank you for the congratulations. All right, go take a sponge bath and try to get you to go back to sleep since all the kids are asleep. That's insane. I would never spend $33,000 on a wedding ever. We were poor when we got married, but even if we had money, I probably wouldn't have paid more than like a thousand dollars. To be honest. Um, I'm just not the kind of person who is into big showy stuff. We had like 
our best friends there and our immediate family and it was really nice. Go take a sponge bath. Oh my god, kid! What do you want now? Get out. You can get out by yourself. I know you can. There you go. I like how he giggles. Hee 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 hee. Weddings in your area all have cookie tables? I don't know what that is. At our wedding, we did, um, the only tradition that we really did was we did, we light, we lit the unity candle together. And then we just, I walked down the aisle, um, and then we said our vows. It was really, it was like, it was like 10, 15 minutes. We were out, we were done. <laughs> Uh, oh, and when I was trying to light the unity candle, it, it went out. <laughs> I was like, what does this mean? So it was my turn, so like each of us had to take the candle over, and then we lit this candle together, but my candle kept going out. And I was like, what is this? Is this a sign? But obviously it was not a sign. We, had, we ended up having a really great marriage. <laughs> um, all right, this kid wants some food, so let's give him a bottle. You got married in Vegas? <laughs> you were four months pregnant. I love that. Yeah, I heard that the My Wedding Stories was really buggy when it came out. What gameplay mechanic does The Sims 4 do best? Well, I love the club system in The Sims 4. I think it's the best feature that that game has. <laughs> oh, thank you, future spooker. Your parents forget their wedding anniversary almost every year. We never forget ours, but like this year, we didn't really do anything. This was our 10 year anniversary. Andrew and I were married for 10 years this year and we didn't do anything because I was so sick. I was so sick because I was pregnant and we were like, you know what? Having us being able to have our child, that's like the best gift we could have. So we're not, we were not upset about it. We got married in 2012. Um, can you, yes, harvest. We got some more squash. Harvest tomatoes. Tomatoes? <laughs> Your dating anniversary is today? Well, happy dating anniversary. <laughs> yeah, we'll save the celebrations for our 11th anniversary. I wanted to go on a cruise. I want to go on a cruise so bad. But you can't go, like, I don't want to go when I'm pregnant. Because, like, I couldn't drink or anything, and, I, and I'd be sick, probably. <laughs> but I want to go on a cruise, so maybe next year we can go. I used to say I would never go on a cruise, like, I was one of those people. Like, I would never go on a cruise, because I heard that, like, so many people get lost at sea, and it really freaked me out. And then I started watching people's travel vlogs of going on cruises, and I was like, that looks awesome, and I want to do that. Hi, Jean. You know what? I'm just going to have you sleep. Just go to sleep. Ah, uh, thank you so much, uh, Zero Nocter. Thank you so much for the tier one sub. You're getting married in September. Congratulations. That's awesome. Yeah, it's amazing how things we said we'd never do start to seem like lovely ideas. Yeah. You change, you know, you change your mind over time. So now, like, I really want to go on a cruise. And then I started showing the vlogs to Andrew. I was like, check this out. This is what a cruise is like. And he was like, yeah, I want to do that too. A Disney cruise. I want to do a Disney cruise so bad. Disney cruises are more expensive than, like, a carnival cruise. You Because you can get a cruise cheap. Like, But even a Disney cruise is, like, way cheaper than going to Disney World. Um, I would do a Medi uh, probably a Mediterranean cruise or like a, what's it called? What's the, what's the cruise called that goes like, I don't remember what they're called. Is it Mediterranean? Uh, no, I haven't seen Emma cruises, but I'll check that out. Well, Carnival, there's Carnival, there's Royal Caribbean. I would do either one of those. Yeah. 
<laughs> I think it would just be so relaxing compared to what we usually do. That kid just sitting in there. Oh, it's time to go. All right, y'all, it changed seasons. I'm going to save here. And we played this family. We got another child for this family. So next time, let me go out to the, um, what do you call it? Neighborhood. Can't think anymore. Do, 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 do. Oh, going to Greece. Yeah, that'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, I'll check her. I'll check out her channel. Because I haven't seen her before. That I know of. Maybe I have. I watched a bunch of cruise videos. Um, so next time we will be playing the drinks family. We got our cold drinks, our hot drinks, and our little baby Luke drinks. That's what we'll be playing next time. <laughs> Roy Royal Caribbean Royal Caribbean is nice, yeah. I'd be happy if EA said they would fix this. Well, no, no, no. I take that back. If EA said they were going to fix The Sims 2, I'd be like, you keep your dirty, grubby hands off my game. <laughs> You're going to destroy it. <laughs> okay, all right. Um, I, I did save it, and I'm going to... Yeah, I saved her. I was going to save from the neighborhood screen. I was like, wait a minute. All right, guys. Well, I guess I'm going to wrap up the stream here. Let me move my mic up so you can hear me. Hopefully it's not crackling. Yeah, add lag and bugs. That's how they'd fix it. I don't want them touching it, honestly. Unless they're going to do, like, a remaster or something. And then I would rather if EA didn't do it, but... Thank you, guys. I miss you all so much. It was so much fun to stream again. Um, I'm definitely going to try to stream again on Saturdays. Unless anything happens. Thank you. <laughs> and, oh, yeah, ba I told you I'd show you my baby bub. Okay, hold on. I'll show you again. Oh, hold on. Oops, I can't hear. I popped. I popped, y'all. <laughs> hey. Oh, here, Andrew says hi. Look at it. Here, look. Andrew got the rest of his sleeve done. Look at that. Look at that beautiful tattoo. <laughs> you're leaving for work? Yeah. I thought you're gonna you're gonna feed the dogs? Okay, love you. Love you Bye. Bye. Um, oh, hey, hey there, Alina. Thank you so much for the 24 months in Tier 3. Thank you so much. <laughs> you got an ad? Wow, that... I thought you were... Okay, thank you for the sub. McKay all day. I thought you already subbed. That's weird. I don't know why, but thank you for the sub. It's like showing I don't know what it's I don't know what it's doing now. I'm going back over here because I don't like how big that is. <laughs> Alright guys, so yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for all the subs and bits. I really appreciate that. And uh yeah, I'm gonna have a new video out for you next week on my YouTube channel, so keep an eye out for that. And thank you guys for joining me. Yeah. Guess that's all I've got all I've got for you today. <laughs> I love you guys and I will see you soon. Bye.